Morning, lads. What day are we today? Are we Wednesday? Are we having a happy Wednesday? Ooh, yeah. Good timing, just as the music turned off. Morning. Good morning, good morning. How are we doing? Happy Wednesday. Oh, oh, lovely coffee. Dymo, good morning. Howdy, howdy. I would not even good morning. Haley, good morning. Blood, good morning. Mr. West, Hana, SJ. Good morning, good morning. I ate a cupcake before I came on. <laughs> oh, delicious. With their coffee. Oh. <laughs> no better pleasure in the world, eh? All right, I want to get a water up for Quest for Glory. Oh, interesting. I just, so I, I just, I just got a notification from Twitch. I mean, just like 20 hours ago. Um, they are removing the react feature from channel pages. Do you guys, did you guys ever see the react feature? So it was, um, I don't know if it's still there. Well, they've already removed it. Um, it was so that you could submit reactions. There was a react feature. Yeah, so if I said something super funny, like always, you know, um, you <laughs> could click a button and kind of like add a reaction to it, which would then send me the data. Uh, it's not on there anymore. Um, basically, it would I could then see it in like the back end that you guys thought the stream was super funny at a certain time. The idea is to give like me more feedback. I read but... a theory that the reason time seems to speed up as you age is partially oh, due yeah. to the fact that there are less new experiences each day as an adult. Do you think, is that actually, I guess so, because when you do something new, you, it feels like, yeah, it feels, you know, you remember it better, it feels like it goes slow because you're in it. Hmm. I always thought that it was because each uh, day is less of a percentage of your life, so it feels like it is going faster. But I think I prefer that one because it's less, I feel like that this one, um, I feel I feel like that take on it is less uh, depressing. <laughs> Because you can set, you can kind of get more experiences that makes the day feel slower, right? Whereas if it's just set in stone that it's always going to feel quick, then it's a bit more depressing, right? Digits, thank you for 30, 43 months. <laughs> thank you for not choosing a new experience for 43 months. I really appreciate that. <laughs> really appreciate that you picked the same experience. Yeah. Uh, no, it wasn't with emotes. It, well, it was kind of, so, what you'd get when you clicked the react button. So it used to be, like, here, um, down here, and you'd click on it, and it would come up with, you could, like, say that you, you thought something was, like, love, or it was, like, some basic... Theft. <laughs> you very much. What about, what was the opposite of heroic? Like, cowardly theft? But that doesn't quite have the same ring to it, does it? Yeah, then an hour felt like an eternity when I was a kid. Oh my god, yeah, like getting through the school day. I used to be like, right, I just have to make it through 15 minutes. And then I have to do that three three more times after this 15 minutes. And then my, like, my lesson's finished and I can go home. Villainous theft. I think I prefer villainous theft than heroic theft. It's kind of more, um, it's more spicy, Craving right? philanthropy. <laughs> quiet doesn't that have more of a ring to it right a bit of craven philanthropy it's a bit more spicy a bit more you know it's got a bit more je ne sais quoi to it good morning fog good morning have you come to say good morning as well oh hello everyone mm. i know Haley. i know you could put the sad face Put the sad face that it's very sad that the reactions are going away. 
like <laughs> some kind of coward. <laughs> yeah, I feel like coward isn't the right word, is it? Eef. Quiet, did you did you see the react feature has been taken away from Twitch, which is an absolute travesty considering we used it so often. I was always going through my reactions. <laughs> no, I think I, I do think a couple of people use did you just burp. Yeah, you did. Um <laughs> The feature that you could click on that allowed you to react to moments on people's streams to tell them how funny they were. Hey, Vi Victus, good morning. I did watch, we watched a Klingon episode um, recently, yesterday. Yesterday, I think. Um, day before yesterday. It's a good one. Well, no, it wasn't. It was actually a really shit episode. It was the one where Captain Archer just lied. Um, it was the one where Captain Archer gets captured by the Klingons and they have to. Um, uh, there's a whole trial thing, and it is the most boring episode. Yeah. I'm not making stuff up. Yeah, some people used it. Hang on, let me go into my analytics. I'll be my... Uh, oh, Christ, what is it going to be under? Engagement, maybe? Uh, reactions. Applications. Description. I bet I'm not going to be able to find it now. Are you on stream summary? Reactions? No, they're wiping it. They're wiping it from the internet. I swear it existed. So there was this little button. It had a plus and it had a guy that was going like this. It was, it was like this. And you click on it and you could say, wow, that was really funny. That was a really funny moment. So when the streamer would go into their stream analytics, they would go, wow, at five minutes in, I was hilarious. Everyone reacted to that, that it was so funny. You know, I don't think it was great for my channel because I'm so consistently hilarious. Um, the, you know, you guys be reacting all of the time. <laughs> See, right now you'd be pressing the laugh feature right now. Badger. You don't need to make up Twitch features just to impress us. We think you're neat without lying like that. That <laughs> <laughs> came right out of my nose. <laughs> Thank you very much. At least you still got that. I'm not lying. I can show you the notification telling me the bad news. Look, all right, look, maybe I was just one of the cool kids that got led into a beta or something, all right? Rug used to react to stuff. I'll ask Rug. Hey, Ramley, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Hang on, it's decidedly so. No, I'm not lying, though. I'm not. <laughs> Got a notifications. Today, we're removing the react feature. Feature, uh, feature from channel pages. Reactions would no longer appear in your stream summary page as a result. C C C And there was a cooldown and um Yeah, I think I think Twitch thought it was gonna be the new big thing. Uh it's to in the viewer engagement channel uh panel. Viewers engagement, right? The viewer engagement panel. Ah, I swear to God. Maybe they won't show you all your previous reactions, or maybe just no one reacted for like months on end. Mm. <laughs> mm. Thank you, Shitwind. You, how did you feel after you reacted? <laughs> How did it make you feel? Hey, Sack, good morning. Did it did it make you feel like you were doing um <laughs> you were doing good? Confused and embarrassed. <laughs> oh my god. 
Archer. I um, forgot April Fool's Day is coming up. It's another couple of months. No, well, another couple of months. Oh, isn't it quite funny that April Fool's lands on Easter Monday? It's because it's... <laughs> Because Jesus was like, oh, Lameo, April Fools, I'm not actually dead. Everyone knows we stoically watch this channel with no reaction. <laughs> Good, that's what I expect from you all. Mm. I don't think I watch that many reactions. I don't, uh, don't think I do. Um, no, because usually I just want to watch, sometimes I'll watch, um, so there's this lady that does baking videos that will sometimes, um, like kind of myth bust baking videos. And it's, um, it's kind of interesting. So she'll watch like shorts, um, that say if you stick your dirty cum sock in a cake, it will make it taste like cotton candy. So she will... <laughs> Then do it to kind of myth bust um, that it doesn't, uh, that that doesn't. Yeah, the Australian lady. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's her, what's her uh, channel name? Um... No, I didn't watch. <laughs> it's just an example. It's just an example, not a. <laughs> no, it's me. <laughs> Well, you know, now reactions are gone, Haley. I don't have much to do with my weekend. <laughs> Quest for glory, everyone. Quest for glory. Not that one. This one. Da 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 da. Let me change the music as well to something a little bit more appropriate. Um. Right. Is this? This isn't the right one. Greg, excuse me. My God, goodness me, I let him turn on the game once and all of a sudden. God, he's trying to fucking trick us. Hang on, lads. Greg, where's Quest for Glory? <laughs> oh, there it is. Um, I don't want the eight remake. Why can I only access the remake? Oh. Maybe, okay, hang on. Bear with me, bear with, bear with. Oh, I see, I see what Greg did wrong. There you go. Fix it. Alright, let me look for some music to put on. Because Quest for Glory is silent otherwise. <laughs> it's another one of those really eerily silent games. Um, we could listen to the Quest soundtrack. Or like, um... There we go. Uh, album, I guess. Can we still call them albums now? <laughs> you Haley. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> ah, you know. <laughs> guess I guess it's unique, isn't it? Here you go. <laughs> Who did you send it to, Reveling? Send it to the family group chat. OST's original soundtracks. It's not an um, not an OST though. It's a like a, it's an album put out by a, a person. Of music. <laughs> God, I feel so old. Oh, I don't even feel old. I think old people would know what albums are. I think I'm just stupid. Hey Jeffrey, good morning. I sent it to my girlfriend. Okay, that's not too bad. <laughs> 
it would have been worse if you'd sent it to your mum. Unless they're the same people, in which case I suppose you've got bigger problems. Oh, I'll turn off. Well, watch the uh, watch the intro. Uh... I do like this like Sierra splash screen. This is still the wrong game. I clicked on EGA. I swear I clicked on EGA. Oh, rambling, you misspelled. <laughs> you made a bit of a spelling, spelling error there. All right, there we go. A spelling error that Twitch didn't like. Oh, now you can't see it. This is going great. It's a good day for me today. Good day. Uh, is this... ah. Got it. Please do not make illegal copies. Right, can we continue the quest? Bully, grotesque, fox band. God, I don't know. I'm panicking without the react button. I don't know what to do without like the instant feedback. This <laughs> is AI Badger. <laughs> Look how many fingers I got. Oh, wait. <laughs> it must be AI Badger. I've got one too many fingers. <laughs> Imagine wanting a hero and getting a petty thief. Look. <laughs> What, what was it? Um, a craven philanthropist, I prefer. All right, we were doing something here. For immediate release, mm -hmm. the Nova Silicon Kingsguard has announced that all streams oh. of the game Quest for Glory have been officially commandeered to assist in the search for lost Nova Silicon Crown Princess Sonya Nevermind. As the outbreak of disappearing princesses has seemingly spread from yeah, all I was gonna nations say. to nations like the United Kingdom, we hope <laughs> that we can find our beloved Tangerine Rose of Nova Selic soon. I was gonna Join say. Join the search today. Nova Selic for life. Our lives for Nova Selic. Gullix, thank you very much. Thank you. You know, I, I probably say this every time we talk about Sonia, never mind. But I've been thinking about thinking about finishing Dagger Romper. Not on stream. Off stream. Um just been thinking about it. Just just, you know, just thinking. Kate Midland isn't dead. She's not I'm sure she's not dead, right? I'm sure I think she's just sick. I think she's just sick. And they didn't want us to know she was sick, so they put out a weird AI picture of her her and her kids. Um, and then tried to say no, it's just because Kate really loves editing. Um, but I don't know why she would edit her son's fingers like that. Um, so you know, it's a it's a whole it's a whole hoo ha. I don't see anywhere that she's dead at the moment. So I like the thing is is Kate's quite popular. She's quite, they wouldn't murder her. She would have to have died of natural causes. Like she's quite, she's quite popular. Some people have said it's because they're getting a divorce, but I don't know. Hmm. Why can't they just take a picture of her and send it? <laughs> I suppose maybe she maybe she doesn't want a photo taken. I don't know why they can't just take an old one. Yeah. I am. Yeah, I'm actually like third in line for the throne. Move it out of the way, Prince Harry. Right, let me uh, give you an introduction. For story so far, there's no backstory. We're just a mere adventurer 
Uh, leaves our hometown of Willowsby to prove ourselves as a bon bona fide hero. Uh, we've noticed in our home adventurers guild a notice for a hero wanted in Spielberg Valley, which is where we are at the moment. Um, no experience necessary. So we've come to Spielberg and we found that the son of the local lord, I think, and daughter of the local lord are missing. Um, so I'm presuming that those are the people we're supposed to be uh finding we have also we encountered some kind of witch who wanted the, our seed so we gave her our seed and then we've now walled off to a different um part of the yeah a dryad not a witch sorry yeah, yeah diana was popular she was but she wasn't um she wasn't married to charles at the time though my thought was is that they they wouldn't want to kill <laughs> wouldn't want to kill Catherine because she is still in like in line to be queen um consort right hey bread good morning what do you think's happened to princess Catherine? yeah if you could jeff if you could ask around in all of these lordly circles ask lady jeffrey Mm -hmm. It was a dryad, not a witch, so it's alright. She can have my seed. <laughs> right. Uh, can I check my inventory? Um, there we go. Uh, we've got a food ration, a dagger, leather armor, two pieces of paper, ten small apples, one music box, a spirally seed, a lock pick, a thief's guild license, and empty flasks, some mushrooms. Um, and we've got a spell for calm and open. Calm and um, open. Oh, oh we, got a, we got a, what was it? What, what, what was it? Was it a follow bot or was it an um, art bot? Was it, a bunch, was it a bunch of followers? Oh, dang, I missed out on being famous. <laughs> I am going to be famous. Dang. Right within my grasp as well. I was reading that. We were about to consider the offer. <laughs> Thank you, Fred. Hmm. Maybe if I became more famous, I could petition Dan Clancy to bring the react button back. Maybe I should cast Calm to see if these little guys, or if I stand on them, maybe. If I stand on it, it will raise me up. The meeps, you're in the meeps peep. The colorful furry meeps timidly pop out of their holes from time to time. Can I touch? I'm not sure what I'm trying to do. Um, look hole. You keep seeing differently colored meeps come out of each hole. They either lead to a large underground cavern or they all connected under the earth like diglets. <gasps> Bread. But isn't it... Um... Is it six days in seven days, or is it seven days in a month? Really? Yeah, that's pretty good. See if you can refresh World it as well. famous voice actor Christ Pratt here, oh greeting the message you missed with oh, my thank pure you. voice acting talent. Oh, good. Hello. Oh, wonderful. Sorry for bothering you. I want to offer promotion of your channel, viewers, oh, followers, views, famous. chat bots, etc. The price is lower than any competitor. The quality is guaranteed to be the best. Oh, the best. Flexible and convenient order management panel, chat panel, everything is on. And you missed the bit that they were advertising that the platform. That's perfect. Mr. West, thank you very much. 
Thank you. It cut just at the right point as well. It's perfect. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry to bother you. I just noticed that you're not famous yet, but you should be. Trust me, I'm the person who decides who's famous. <laughs> wink, wink, visit my site, Totally Real Marketing for Followers. Edu. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> God, that's amazing. I wonder if anyone does. I wonder. I I wonder. Do you guys know anyone who might have bought? <laughs> like starting the gossip circle. Does anyone know? Anyone know of anybody who might have bought some of us? <laughs> oh, goodness me. A legitimate opportunity to become the world's most famous streamer. Did I? Hang on. My reply is no. All right. All right. We, we'll get another chance later on. Phew. It's a re it is a relief. World famous. Nah, you know, the only world famous person is Chris Pratt. They'd never admit if they did. That's true. That's true. I wonder if you'd be able to tell. I'm so nosy. Like, I like looking through people's Christmas cards now. I'm like, hmm, maybe if I look through their viewer list, maybe it'll be like, <laughs> follow bot one, follow bot two. <laughs> I'm sure they think of something a bit more of, if you're wanting to, I'm sure they think of some, like part of the deal is that they'll think of something uh, interesting. Oh, I can pause. Oh, that's amazing. Every hero needs a break. That's me. This is me. Auntie Po, good morning. Hello. And I'll be back. Good morning as well. And Brett. A big congratulations. A big congratulations. Don't worry if it like if if Twitch is fucked up, let them fuck up. If you missed one stream, it don't matter. <laughs> A big congratulations on reaching affiliate. That's amazing. Well, you're gonna have your remotes be. I hope they're little breadsticks. Hey Kenzo, good afternoon. I wonder if I could pick like pick them up. Pick up what were they called? Moop. What was it? What were they called? Meep meepers, meeps. Pick up. Meep. Oh I can! Oh, this is harassment. Oh, um. Mm. I will ask for help if I need it today as well. We'll see how well I do without, um, without any, any, uh, what's the word? Without any instructions, I guess. No. Oh, what about like cast calm and calm them down? Oh, bread fox. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. What's a PNG tuber? <laughs> Is that like a little PNG, PNG of a potato? Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> you get it? It's a tuba. I made a joke about a tuba. You can all laugh now if you'd like. Hey, McFly. <laughs> Good morning. Yeah, thank you, thank you. I'm here. If four out of the seven days of the week. There's no reactions. You can't laugh. You just gotta be. <laughs> We've got some mushrooms. We could feed them the mushrooms. We could murder them. Your score is inadequate. <laughs> You'll have to repeat the mission. Is that you wanting me to repeat the joke? Because I can do that. Um, <coughs> a PNG tuba? Is that like a picture of a potato? 
Did it get better the second time or is it still pretty? You were laughing too much to type. All right, okay, yeah, I can understand. <laughs> Stupid mo armor. That's what I expect you to always be like when you're watching this stream, just constantly liquid flowing out of your nose because it's so funny. Oh, is it talking? Oh, I see, I see. Let's swap so my audio is being picked up. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. So will it like, um... Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Like a like a VTuber, but not quite a VTuber, right? Um, I like how I'm immediately like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to cheat. After me saying, don't give me any clues, guys. Don't give me any clues. But I'm a cheat. <laughs> um, I don't know if this is time sensitive or whether, it, whether I should be like, oh, that's nice, but pause. Um. Oh, you guys remember we found Baba Yaga as well? Um, I am looking for the meep, meep thing. Uh. Let's see if I can find what I'm doing with these meeps. Oh, I might just be able to talk to them. I should have really started off with that. Good morning, Hell Dog. Good morning, good morning. Happy Wednesday. You hear a squeaky muttering. I should have really just tried for conversation first. I was there trying to like pull them out of their homes. Oh, I missed that. Never mind. Hiya, hiya. Pleased to meet you. Oh, wow. There are, those are some feet, aren't they? Just ask me about anything you want to know. Bordazar. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. How is your, how's your march going? Makes a great babysitter. Yeah, you never have to hire one again after you, um, after you hire. <laughs> uh, what was their name? Like a duke? Um, Lord? Gee, boss, I don't know much about that at all. Hey, sorry. Oh, Baron, yeah. Okay, doesn't know. Ask about Baron's daughter. Don't know much about that. Ask about. Sent me the PNG. I'll check it at the end. I don't have to tap out. Um. Oh, and you can make little emotes out of. That's so cute. Oh, I'm excited. I've got like a, I fucking love seeing other people's emotes. My favorite, like, my favorite things. Um, maybe ask about, oh, the boot. Well, settled in the new house, new old job. How's it been? How's it been? We're happy meeps living in our happy holes. Don't worry, be happy. Ask about hole. Oh. Gee, boss, I don't know much about that. Can I get in his hole? I kind of need a rest as well. You keep differently cut, uh, okay, that's fine. Can I get in a hole? How big's your hole? Enter hole. Oh, F3, yeah. I was wondering what to, um, I remember. Do you have any hemorrhoids? Have I cat Has it broken? Oh, I bugged out. 
Oh, good for me then. <laughs> well, it gives me a chance to look at Brett's PNG. <laughs> if it's not a PNG of a potato, I'm going to be upset. A tuba. Bread. Right, we were on bully. Oh my god, that's cute. That's cute. Oh, stop. It's like a um, a baguette in the shape of a fox. Super cute. Maybe a little bit of rosemary. That's super cute. I love that. Yeah, that's cool. That's some solid branding as well. Mm -hmm. Maybe I... Uh, let's just do all the things that we did before. There you go. See, blue meeps, purple meeps, occasionally a green meep. Can be very shy. Talk to meep. Oh. Pull rock? I want to touch his rock. Grab, take. Okay, there we go. Do I have to wait until he... There we go. There he is. Can I ask about his feet, do you think? Don't know much about all that, okay. Ask about... Ask him about meeps. Uh, ask about adventure, maybe? Ask for feet pics. He does have some good feet, doesn't he? How, how girthy do you think his toes are? Um, maybe ask about... Where are we? What is this place called? Whoa. Oh, yeah. I, I bet he's got some fresh fucking toe jam. <laughs> uh, <laughs> where are we? Somewhere beginning with S, I think. Uh, Spielberg. There go. Like Steven Spielberg. G boss don't know about that. Okay, good. This guy doesn't seem very, like, very useful. Not to be rude to him, but like a little bit rude. Son! Son, thank you very much for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. Thank you very much. Welcome in. What were we up to? While you're streaming, while you're retroing today? Hello? Welcome in. Come in, welcome in. James, welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Finnell, good morning. Ian, good morning as well. Welcome in, Raiders. We are quest for glorying today. We are searching for glory. Um, we are at the moment looking at some gentlemen in holes, which has nothing to do with glory holes, but odd. Odd crossover. Um, yeah, we are. <laughs> I don't know how far we are through. Because I, we're not looking. We are. I do have a walkthrough, but we're not following the walkthrough. So I'm not entirely sure how far we are through. A quest for the glory hole. PS One. Good day. Good day. Good morning. Spent a lot of my childhood playing this game. Did you cut? Did you play it when it first came out? Topia. I was playing janky retro. Oh, Armith, the Long Kingdom. The Long Kingdom. A janky clone of King's Quest. Is it, is it particularly long? I need to know. <laughs> I need to know why it's being called the Long Kingdom. Oh, thank you, bro. Thank you for adding that quest right. Uh, that quote right now. He has got some nice feet. Oh, the Lost Kingdom. I was quite excited by a particularly long kingdom, to be honest. Like really long. Oh yeah, I'm 113 out of 500. So like a fifth of the way through, but sometimes we don't always make it to the full score at the end. So like I'm gonna, 
I'm gonna say a quarter because it makes me feel better about myself. It's 40 feet wide and goes for miles. Oh, that's quite long considering how long these feet are. <laughs> oh dear. Ask about, okay. We've got to ask him about rocks. We use rocks for doors. They keep us dry and warm. And then we've got to ask him about his fur. Hey, like fur is good and stuff. Keeps us warm. Mine's the best. It's like green, you know. Furry. Ask about green fur. Yeah. How girthy are those feet? Oh, do you want some green fur? I think I have some green fur around here. No, I don't want your stinky green fur. There you go. Hope it helps you. Oh, that's fucking rude, isn't it? Throwing it on the floor. That's like when someone throws their, <laughs> their change on the floor for you to pick up. I'm sure what you're trying to do. I'm trying to pick up the shit on the floor. Pick, pick up. Pick it up and place it in your purse. Girl, I'm questing for glory. What you stop trying to find a man in these halls? So what's the goal? So what's the goal? Oh, we are um, we're trying to find. Well, so we don't actually technically have a goal. The goal is just to be um, an adventurer. But I think the goal is gonna be the local baron's son and daughter have gone missing. So I think the the goal will be to find a son and daughter. Yeah, I'm trying to pick up fur. Pick up fur. I'm not sure what you're trying to do. What are you trying to do? <laughs> uh, look fur, maybe? Okay, pick up. Just, you, you, just like you grab it. Grab it. Dice more. Good morning. And G Funk, welcome in as well. Come in, welcome in. What would it grab? I'm trying. I'm trying to put it in my hands and then put it in my pockets. No, but I asked him about his fur, and then he said, "Oh, hey, I've got green fur." So you then I was like, "Yeah, sure, cool. Ask about your green fur." I got it. Take an uh, apple core. You look at the apple cores and quickly decide they're no use to you. Besides, they look disgusting. Disgusting. Don't eat. Don't take somebody's half-eaten apple. <laughs> I'll skip nicely to get it in my pocket. Please, if you don't mind. Go. You pick up the spell scroll. As the magical runes fade, you find you know how to cast the detect magic spell. Nice! Um, what is the time as well? Um, I would like to know the time. Time of day. Mid afternoon on day three. I want to make sure that we get back to the um so there's an inn. I want to make sure that we get back to the inn. I should save. I need to save. Um before it gets dark. Because we were a bit saggy last time, actually. Um, furry. Okay. Was it the boots or the fur? Um, we needed the fur and the scroll. Oh yeah, there was that hermit, wasn't there? Yeah, the end does cost money. Hostile intent is evidence. You prepare for battle. Oh. I don't remember the buttons. I don't remember the buttons. I died. <laughs> it was a tough battle. You lost. Never fear. All you have to do is restore your game and... What do you mean? Restore what game? Yeah. Sad. Look at that. Look at Roberta's face. She's disappointed in me. Oh, go away. Oh, mushrooms. Okay, he didn't follow me. Scaring a plane. 
as his mother's good china. Oh, this is the, um, there's like a go goblin. Oh no. Oh no. Is she down there? I can't see. I can't smell her either. Oh Lord. Oh, I got stuck. Run. Oh no. This oh. Is she there? Cute. She had a nap on my lap over lunch today. Just fucking run. Just run. There we go. This is Baba Yaga's house, if you can hear me over the really loud music. <laughs> Baba Yaga lives there? Uh, this skull wanted something from me. Baba Yaga does not welcome strangers. You have to deal with me before you can enter. I don't remember what he wanted. <laughs> what was that, Fred? Turn the music up. Baba Yaga is one tough magic user. You, uh, you're so stupid that you want to enter. Perhaps we can make a deal. Baba, uh, yeah, what's the deal? Just gonna turn it down! <laughs> Christ. <laughs> what was that? Today's tip of the day. What? Make Thanks, sure Sauce? To always eat mushrooms and half eaten apples oh. off the floor to become powerful. I had mushrooms for lunch today. With Snow White. What? <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I wouldn't mind seeing Chris Pratt in a Snow White outfit. All the other skulls have glowing eyes, but me? No, I don't need some lovely glowing eyes. I just open and close the gate. That's all I'm good for. But if you can give me a glowing gem for my eyes, I'll open the, day, uh, the gate. Uh, can I give gem? I don't know if I've got one. Yes. I mean, this is an adventure game. Yes. The deal is made then, a glowing gem in exchange for an opportunity to see Baba Yaga herself. I don't know if I've got a gem, but we'll... You don't have it, okay. Alrighty then, whore. Oh. Silence is nice, isn't it? Oh. Dinosaur. I went the wrong way. I think we've done this. Did I do this already? I seem to remember shimmying up here. <sighs> yeah, we did do this. Mm. <gasps> oh no. Bravely run away! Bravely run! Oh god. Oh Christ. <laughs> Not that! No! Run! Not that way! Yeah, the quest for Glory's game gave me hella anxiety. Always worried about doing things wrong and having to start over. So I am perhaps uh, incorrectly hoping that I'm not going to get soft locked. Uh, I, <laughs> I am living on a prayer, as Mr. Jovi would say. And uh, I'm kind of hoping that there isn't that many soft locks in this game. Oh no. Yeah, so we've been soft locked once, haven't we? Oh, evil stuff like killing the stag. Oh, we were all right with that.
Yeah, I'm hoping that maybe Roberta is a bit kinder than she was in King's Quest. A little bit less sadistic. Let's go up. Oh my god. Oh, please. One of the most fair Sierra games. Does it get worse than the other Quest for Glory's game? Games. Oh, please, please, no. Um. Maybe I should rest. Gets worse than two. There's a time limit. Ah, oh, you know how much I like the time limits. I, uh, King's Quest 3 is one of my favorite King's Quest games. Mmm, when Ron Gilbert invented flowcharts, I used to hate flowcharts. Now I know who the man behind them is. I did genuinely hate flowcharts at school. Oh, I don't want to be in Bobby Yaga's house. Oh my god, please, sir. Sir, do you not have, like, a better hobby to do than harass me? Oh god. Well, I thought I'd ask the house nicely. To let me in. Okay. Will you guys judge me if I look at a, uh, a map? No, Badger, we won't judge you. Oh, fantastic, good to, good to know. Um, right. We want to be making it back to the town of Stilberg, I think. Captain Dan, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in, Captain. Come in. I'm just trying to figure out where we are right now. We are in the Gobbo... The GCT Goblin Combat Training Area. Uh, Gobbo Combat Training Area. Okay, I found it. So I need to go down. Right, I got it. Hand mapping was required in games this old. So true. So true. Ooh. Oh great, it's dark. Oh god, what the fuck is that? What is that? Oh gosh, you're... Oh no. Please just let me run away. Yeah, it wasn't easy, I can imagine. I wonder if I can get back down. Okay, if we go this way, if we go right again, oh my god, what are you? Okay, we're at the wall. This must be the town graveyard. What a rundown place. We did want to go to the graveyard. Did we want to go there at night? <laughs> Roberta sends her regards. It appears that the spirits frolic here during the dark hours. All right, maybe we want to talk to the spirits. No one responds. Hello. Oh dear. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Rev. <laughs> ahoy, ahoy. Do we not want to be here? Are they going to kill me? They seem fun. Oh. Lady's coming down to say hello to us. This is me great. <laughs> As the ghosts suck the life from your body. We got a free suck, guys. Look. Silver lining. Um, as you crumple onto the dust of the old graveyard, you think about think unspeakable thoughts of torture and torment directed at the programmers, game designers, and various artists, vicious artists, named Ken. Curse you, Ken. Was that Ken Williams? 
Right, where the absolute fuck am I now? Okay, goblin training camp. Na, 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 na. We do kind of want to go down to the graveyards though. The graveyard though. Ken with two ends as well. It's a bold way to spell Ken. Can I look at the graves? Now it's um grave. Nothing grows in the dirt of the old graveyard. Some of the graves appear to have been disturbed. Feeling that we had to come here for whatever reason. Now we're going to be entering... What was this? Is this the like archery training area? For some reason I can't make it in there. Right, so if I go down here, go right here. Hmm. Oh, for training my dagger throwing, that makes sense. All right, go up. There we go. I made it back. If anything, I just kind of want to be here. I just <laughs> want to be here for the comfort. It's short for it, Ken. I'm just Ken. <laughs> Anywhere else I'd be a 10. I'm not close enough to the door. We did accept all of these quests, I think. Post seems to be here for a while. Reward 50 goals. Uh, yeah, this is fine. That's so I think this is what we're doing. Uh, reward for 50 goal, uh, or 50 goals for information leading to the return of Baronet Bernard von Spielberg. Inquire at the Spielberg Castle Gates. And that guy told me to fuck off when I went um, and said that the Baron was not willing to talk to anyone and that I had to come back with some kind of quest item, which I've now forgotten. Good afternoon, fourth. Spell components needed cash or trade for potions in Quirate Healers. Um, reward of 30 gold coins for capture of death of the Brigand Warlock. Description short, ugly, and wears brightly colored robes. Has a habit of laughing continually in quiet at Spielberg Castle gates. Um, reward of 50 coins for the safe return of Elsa von Spielberg. Require inquire at Spielberg Castle gates. Um, and reward for return of lost ring. Require inquire at healers. Uh, wanted brigand leader. Description unknown appearance. Wears a cloak. Must provide proof of leader's identity. Reward of 60 gold coins and title of hero of the realm. Her brother's only worth 50 as well, but the brigand leader, he's worth 60. I don't think we've got any spell components. They are. I think they might kill you though, Rev, after they've gotten you. If it's in adjusted for inflation. Excuse me, it's a cost of living crisis. Can I just... There we go. Um... Just having to think about maybe what I want to do. I was hoping we could go to the inventory just by me pressing I, but no. Um, so we've got the Thieves Guild license, empty flask, handful of green fur, we've got three mushrooms, three pieces of paper, ten small apples, one music box, one spira seed. Did I not give the seed to that dryad or did I give the seed to the dryad? Does anyone remember if I gave the dryad the seed or not? I check. I think I did. Protector of the woods sleep. She's known to ask favor though. She thinks friends of the forest and is willing to return favors. I feel like I did. Because there was that, um, I still have it. Yeah, I've still got it. Well, I didn't know if she was letting me keep it. Uh, 
Um, head towards the dryad's tree in the southwest corner of the forest. Follow the white stag there. Once there, enter a, an area with a tree. The dryad will pop out for a tree. Ask your friend the forest. We said yes. Um, spore spitting spear area. Once you get there, throw some rocks. We Yeah, we did this. Um, pick it up and head back to the dryad's tree. All right. I didn't give it to her. Let's go back to the dryad then. We might want to go... Um, yeah, I did call her a witch. I did. Do we want to maybe go to the hermit's house first <laughs> as well? Uh, it was by a waterfall, I think, to the right. Um, I don't exactly remember where it was, though. Xjo, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Come in, welcome in. Uh, let me see if I can find where the hermit is on the map that I have. <laughs> Just a little little map, don't, don't worry about it. Uh, healer's hut? No, we don't need to go to the healer's hut. She's already asked us to find her her ring. Um, maybe it's the cave. <laughs> Her it played cribbage? What is cribbage? I feel like cribbage is a very American game. Ah, Flying Falls, that's where he is. I was looking for like cave or something. It's very American old car game. How do you, um, how do you play it? Cribbage sounds like it should have some kind of relationship to Scrabble. And I don't know why. Right. We're gonna go to the hermit's house. We're gonna sleep in his house. Um. I am, I'm like literally licking the door right now. Let me, let me out. Okay. Hey Herbal, good morning. It's like cabbage. <laughs> Sounds like a, something you'd say, like fermented. Oh no, 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 cribbage. Sounds like a kind of a fancy new vegetable that is a cross between a cabbage and some spinach. So we want to go right twice, down twice. One, two. I do like card games. You know I like card games. So maybe cribbage will be... Uh, maybe cribbage will be my new, my new thing. I'm already lost. Good. Good for me. It's fine. It's fine. If I, if I go down. Yeah. One. Two. Look, maps are very difficult to read, all right? Ah, there we go. Lovely. It goes. He's very proud of himself. Now, knock. Hello. <sighs> no, I didn't get I didn't move quick enough. Hey Viola, good morning as well. Come in, come in, good to see you again. Get it's kind of tired. I'm sitting here and thinking about myself all the time. Can I ask you about the memes? Well, seeing as I don't get how much, don't know much. Okay. Can I just sleep in your bed? After having traded a ration, which the hermit promptly allowed, swallowed, and spending a rather boring hour of cribbage and listening to Henry Chatter, you were hit the hay. 
Save and try attacking him. And then I can take his house. Unfortunately, since the fungus on the wall shines at night, the room doesn't get dark, and the fact that the hermit talks most of the night, you only get five hours sleep. You awake as the sun begins to rise. Okay, hang on. Uh, save game. Replace. Went the wrong way. Oopsie. <laughs> you didn't give me much time. This is good for my climbing skills, I guess. Is it worth it? Yeah, at this point, is it worth it? I just want to attack him. Now you kind of have to like a bit of a shuffle. You seem to have made the hermit unhappy. <laughs> oh wow. That hermit seems to know his trigger spells pretty well. He sure pulled the trigger on you, not to mention the plug, by teleporting you to the top of the falls without a barrel. <laughs> oh, I pressed restart. Oh, it's fine. Stop. I wonder if he'll teach me his spells if I ask nicely. We'll ask him. Elpful Enriamit. Henry, helpful Henry Hermit. Right, sir, I'm gonna ask about trigger. It's the spell what sets off other spells. Like when you want to see the ladder, you cast a trigger and there you have it, large as life. Kills, you got to have a spell on the invisible ladder to make it visible first. But it, 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 it as it uses. What? I think I have a scroll with a spell. If you be knowing some magic, that is. If you be wanting to learn the spell, I'll be pleased to share it with you. It's just getting moldy. Molded in me eyed in place. Christ. I'm really struggling with Henry. Yes, I would love it. Let's see. How does Erasmus do it? E summons with a trigger. Here goes. There you raise it. Thank you. Can I take scroll? The scroll vanishes even as you read the magical runes upon it. You now have the knowledge to cast a trigger spell. Fun. Okay, that's good. Thank you. I'm just gonna replace murder with murder. That's fine. SJ, you take a nice nap, all right? Take a nice little sl Oh, shit. We're fine. <laughs> Let's go to the uh, dryad tree then. Oh, I... Ooh, no, we've been here before. Uh, we are a thief, but with a little bit of magic to make life a little bit easier for us. I wanted to be able to do, do just a little bit. Why is it always got to have to do with horses pixels? More like Alf. Oh, what is Alf from? I keep saying Alf. Or oh, I feel like Alf is very American. Alf is the... <laughs> the law that it has to have something to do with uh, horses. Hey Zach, good morning. 
which is one new skill each time in the series. So thief plus mage skill is possible. I think that's what I've got. I think I've got thief plus a little bit of a little bit of mage as well. Alpha's terrible TV show puppets, right? Give the seed. You drop the seed into the dryad's limbs. Now, this will boldly grow where none has grown before. Oh, a Star Trek reference. Heed now my words, friend of the forest, and heed them well. Friend, you must know that there is an evil in this valley which perverts the way of nature. The prophecy says that a hero will bring a young human from out this darkness. If you are the one to accomplish this task, there is a potion to break the enchantments which you must have the healer make. You must gather these ingredients. Flowers from Arena's Peace, green fur, fairy dust, a magic acorn, and flying water. Farewell, friend. I must return to my concentration. May the forest forever surround you. Yeah, she's very eager to call us friends, right? Oh, kick. Uh, take acorn. Right, so we have the acorn. We have the green fur. We needed some flowers and we needed a couple of other bits. Yeah, I did cheat the fur. A little bit. Mm. <laughs> Is Alf an alien? I thought he was a puppet. <laughs> right, so we're at the Dryad's Tree. Uh, where would... So we're looking for some flowers. I, As far as I know. We've got some mushrooms. We've got a handful of green fur. Um, I've kept the music box, so we stole this music box from somebody's house. Um, I think it was the sheriff's house, and I've kept it because it seems to pacify his um, goon. So I've uh, I've kept it just in case. Oh, in the confines of the show, he's an alien. Makes sense. That makes sense. Did anybody watch uh, talking about puppets? <laughs> we have puppets. Um, did anyone used to watch Zippy? Was that what it was called? The the the, the 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 puppet with the zip and then there was the big puppet that was the bear as well. That I well probably wasn't a puppet, it was a man in a suit. Turns out aliens are just puppets. Let's see that. No, do you guys do you guys know the TV show? Hang on. Puppet. Maybe it's the British version of Alf. Oh, Rainbow? Yeah, George Bungle and the human. <laughs> Do the human not have a um, not have a name? Um, it was on in the seventies, eighties, uh, and ended in nineteen ninety two uh, in the UK. I don't think it was um, probably not for America. It was an educational show for children. Jeff. 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 I had a um I had a plush zippy. I also quite liked the hoops. If anyone remembers the hoops? <laughs> As we told, you know, we're on puppet shows. Um and Sooty and Sweep I used to like as well. Oh, there was an adult version of Rainbow. That's so funny. <laughs> Peel a banana and count the skins. What's that? Like, surely it's just... Oh, like count the like little flops. Like how many, how many peels you can get. Fraggle Rock. That is, is Fraggle Rock not um, Alf, no? Fraggle Rock. Let me have a look at a picture of Fraggle Rock. Um, uh, I like I. Maybe we might have seen it. Oh. I don't know whether it's a case where I've seen it as an adult and I've like implanted it into my memories as something that I've seen when I was a child, but it might have been like 
something that was on as a treat. Like, oh, you know, now we've got an American TV show, you know? Whoa. Um, it was on for years in the UK. Maybe I was just amazed that it was an American TV show. <laughs> Mr. Rogers. I never saw Mr. Rogers. We had um, Button Moon, if anyone watched that. Button Moon and... Um, uh, what were they called? The Clangers, spelt with a C. The Clangers were big as well. Um, sorry, I've gotten off of, off Quest of Glory. Yeah, Sooty and Sweep. I used to have a Sooty and Sweep hand puppet. Loved Button Moon. The um, uh, the intro was a fucking banger, wasn't it? <laughs> it's great. Right, we are looking for... Let me just see if I could get the list of what she wanted. I wonder if it'll tell me in the walkthrough. Um, um, We're off to Button Moon. We'll follow Mr. Spoon. Button Moon. Button Moon. <laughs> Thank you. I'd play it if I didn't think that we were going to get copyright strike <laughs> for it. I got a, you know, we played The Weakest Link. I got a uh, copyright, like, warning. Um, not Like, not, I can't remember what it was called. I don't know if Greg's in chat. He knows the term for it. Um, but, because uh, Anne Robinson was like, nah, uh, uh. nah, nah, nah. I I'm 76. I'm 76 rambling. 76 years old. Absolutely ancient. Absolutely ancient. There's nowhere in the... Ah, oh, there we go. It's the spore... Ah, uh, oh, flowers from Arena's Peace. Green fur, which we've got fairy dust. Um... <laughs> Might not get me DMCA, but it also <laughs> might get me banned on another, you know. My Muppet Babies? They did Muppet Babies? They did. I know they did Looney Tunes Babies for ages. Um, Magic Acorn we have and Flying Water. We do have that flask that we took. I wonder if we can put some flying baby, uh, flying babies. Christ. Sorry. <laughs> I was reading Muppet Babies. We could put some flying water in the flask. Um... <laughs> yeah. Um, it's, it's snail, um... Well, it's a snail moisturizer I use to keep my skin looking this young. 76. Yeah, I should definitely capture it. Stuff it in an empty flask. Oh, dear. And we've got to take it to the healer's... Um, healer's hut, okay. So, what I was thinking about for the flying babies... <laughs> I was thinking maybe waterfall. Um, you know the area with the hermit. Wasn't it? Wasn't it called Flying Falls on the um on the map it says FF where I've got to look where we're going. Um, so maybe that's what flying water would be, like water from flying falls. Um so we've got the green fur, then we'll have the Oh shit, wrong way. I think it's straight across. Straight across, yeah. There we go. So hopefully if we can use the flask to take some water. Use flask on water? It's not clear how you want to use that. I want to... This is exactly the motion that I'd like you to use. Yeah, maybe take. Uh, 
Okay. You have filled an empty flask with crystal clear wa water from the waterfall. Five inch floppies. Change the disc every three screens was a pain in the butt. Make <laughs> sure you knew where you were going. Because you had to commit. I don't know whether that might make it easier because you'd oh, make it easier because you'd group each screen into like a group of three, maybe. And it would maybe be easier to know where you're going. I used to love floppy disks. I used to, um, you know, they had the chuk -chuk -chuk thing on the top. I used to sit and like fiddle with them for hours at the PC. Like, I remember having to take school projects in on fucking floppy disks. And, um, you know, I used to make those like PowerPoints where I'd put the music of Take That behind my PowerPoint. I used to bring those in on floppy disks and um, play them. Yeah, they were fairly, you know, why were they called floppy disks anyway? Hey, Chad, how are you doing? What you doing? All right, so we've got the um, magic acorn, flask of water, green fur. We need the berry dust. And what was the last one? Let's see here. Uh, flowers. The flowers. Um. The, I feel like the flowers are maybe going to be the easy one. Um, the only place I could think that we maybe would find some fairies if they're not on a screen that we haven't already been was like maybe the mushroom circle. It's like fairies hang out in mushroom circles, right? The bigger ones were floppy. How big were they? Sounds really creepy. How big were your discs? <laughs> no, we've already found the furries. We've already found them and we ripped some fur out of them. Eight inches. That'd be like one inch. This big. Where would you put these? Mmm. Where did you even, where did you store those? Hey, hi, oh, good morning. Yeah, we are, uh, daylight savings changes for us on the 31st on Easter. Mmm. Do you guys remember those floppy rulers that you used to be able to get? The bendy ones. So cool. <laughs> I felt so cool taking those to school. Right, um, fairies and flowers. And if we've already seen the flowers, where have we seen flowers? Let me have a look at the map and see whether there was somewhere that we've been. I guess, hang on, let me put a more exciting screen on for you guys. Put a pause, that's a bit more, a bit more interesting than the white inventory screen. Let me have a look on the map. Where have we been? Yeah, 10 small apples, I know. Where is he keeping them? He doesn't have enough pockets for 10 small apples. Hey, Selma, good morning. They came with paper covers. Would you have like, um? You know how you can get the CD towers and stuff that you can put all your CDs in? Could you get those for floppy disks? Oh, yeah. Prison pocket, right? Yeah. Prison pocket. Cha-cha-cha-cha. Uh, Where is my map? Okay. If I was a flower, Erin is flowers, weren't they? Or something? Um... There's something called EP on the... Hmm. Snowfield. Flying Falls, which is where we are right now. The mountain. The house. We could go to the house. I'm a weenie again. Hi, oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very, very much for 15 months. Thank you for your prime as well. Come back to the weenies. Yeah, I think we'll go towards the place's EP and hope that it's like Erina's. Um, house, I guess. Uh, so Flying Falls. Ooh, no, no. What? Do I have a PlayStation 5? No, I don't. I do not have a PlayStation 5. I don't. I haven't had a PlayStation since PlayStation 3. 
Oh dear. Can I not get through there? My god. Oh dear. I actually frequently forget that we're already on PlayStation 5s and we're not still on PlayStation 4. Okay, we're at the archery place now. Uh, gone too far. We go this way. Go that way. I know. 19 months. Ah, uh, I, I would. So I will be playing Final Fantasy VII Rebirth when it comes out on PC and when all of them are out on PC. Uh, yeah, this was the wrong way. Probably. Um, I would like to play the re, um, uh, like remake of Final Fantasy VII. Oh, we can sell those mushrooms. We'll keep them for now. Mmm, an entire year? <laughs> Say it isn't so. Oh god, we're gonna get lost. I'm following a map. But this way? And then this way. And then up? The goblin. Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you very much. Unless that's directed at chat and not at me. <laughs> It's like when someone waves at you, but it's actually the person behind you. <laughs> I gonna say thank you. I'm gonna say thank you anyway, because I am part of chat, so. Mm -hmm. As you pick a variety of the sweet smelling flowers, they seem to grow glow in your hands. So you put them safely away. She's a sweetie. Few things I won't play on PC. The Final Fantasy games, other than 14, are Rockstar games. Oh, yeah. And it's quite like I think that some games just work nicer with controller, right? And like sitting on your sofa playing a game is a different experience than having to kind of sit in the desk chair and play a game. Not that you can't kind of get one of those things that mean that you can stream it to your TV, but yeah. No, no, you patch it. Thank you very much, Haley. I'm gonna go this way and have a look. Ah! Oh, oh no, I don't, you know, actually, I don't think I want whatever's going on over there, I don't want. Um. Mm. Still play games all the time on PC. I prefer. I prefer PCs to. Um, consoles largely because you don't I, I was gonna say largely because you don't have to worry about the new console coming out that you're not gonna be able to play your favorite game but I suppose you do have to worry about your PC not having the hardware to run a game that you're looking for uh, looking forward to playing um mm. well, they are coming to PC eventually aren't they uh, I was going to go to the mushroom, um, uh, the, the mushroom place and maybe detect some magic, see if we can summon some fairies. Yeah, exactly, sect. Yeah. Exactly. But I suppose, ooh, I mean, I was going to say, I think that a, co uh, a graphics card outlasts a console, but we are quite far into the console generations now. Like the Switch has been out for how many years? Ah, through your ceiling to your TV. Play the living. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do that with uh, some of the things I want to watch that won't let you. Where am I? Um, have some like copy protection that you can't um like stream them to your. Ah, there we go. This is what I want to be. Yeah, seven years. So. Whether this, oh, but I guess the switch isn't very powerful anyway. But you know, you know what I was trying to get at. <laughs> Barney the purple dinosaur. I loved Barney as well. Barney was super cute. I liked Barney. Mmm. Fixing a motherboard so I can put a Ryzen Seven in my computer. Ooh. 
And you must feel like a real sense of accomplishment. Like it's not only just, um, um, it's not, not only just, you know, getting you the part that you want is also a hobby, right? Who? Shillison? I don't know who that is. And I'd probably, I'd probably call my husband to come and have a look, if I'm honest. <laughs> I'd probably be like, Greg! I don't know who that is. Rapidly approaching our four year of PlayStation 5 Xbox series. Don't consoles usually come out every five years or so, right? Uh, I wanted to detect five years, is it? Detect magic? I'm not sure what you're trying to do. Yeah, making your own Frankenstein monster. It gives you a lot of options to customize as well. Ah, um, oh, cast detect, right. You detect faint eminence of magic near the ring of mushrooms. Hmm. So there is magic, maybe trigger, cast trigger. I'm gonna save actually before we do this. Well, so when do we think the new Switch is coming out? I feel like the Switch will be a good um, kind of... Like a signal for when, how long consoles are being expected to last now. Yeah, like a, a thing, you know, the, the Switch lasts seven years, so we expect the PlayStation 4 or 5 to last, yeah. 2025. I would like a more powerful Switch, I suppose. I, I don't know where I'd buy it, though. I think I'd have a hard time justifying uh, if they just bought out, like, a Switch 2, unless it was... Like, I hope they don't do what they did with a new 3DS. I hope it's not like a new Switch. You know? Uh, cast. Trigger. The spell has no effect. Okay. I want to reload then. Because I don't want to have wasted that mana. Um, if you were a fairy. That's the time. Mid-morning on day four. Um. Okay. I'm trying to think of... Like, fairy tales about fairies. Isn't it like, don't go near the fairy stones, don't put your head underwater, uh, near the fairy stone, uh, near the, like, the mushroom circles, is like, do they come out at night? We could, we could wait until night and see whether they'll come out, because we did see some, like, gobbos or some, uh, we saw some gnomes out and about. Hey, Yesu, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Don't look forward to new consoles anymore. No, because like, I think they would have to find a way for you to be able to pre-order them. Um, hmm. My humble and cheaper PlayStation 2. My PlayStation 2 is um, actually kicking the bucket. It can only play CD games now. It can no longer play DVD games uh, because the opti is it the optical drive has gone in it. Yeah, just try it. Wait for night. We could just rest. Rest. I'm too impatient. I don't know how to pass time. I kind of just want to hang around until night time. Mm. Yeah. I, I don't... Well, do we think the Switch, the new Switch will be backwards compatible as well? I think with how big the Switch library is is um i think it would be very saggy if it wasn't loss thank you for the three years 
three months, 17 days, and 22 hours. How many minutes, though, Loss? How many minutes? Thank you so, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the 50 pound donation. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Goodness. Making me feel old as well. I could try and climb trees, lower my stamina. Low stamina lets me rest. If I run around as well. You know what we could do? We could sneak. We could sneak around. Couldn't we? That would be training our sneak. I'm pruned. I'm pruny, I know. And this year I'm turning 76 again. Yeah, the GameCube wasn't the Wii and the Wii U were. The Switch isn't. I know. But the Switch has got that wonderful li retro library if you just pay <laughs> the low, low price of a, a Nintendo Online subscription. Yeah. Oopsies. Yeah, it's true. You can put Nintendo 64 cartridge into a CD player. Yeah, if you pay for Nintendo Switch Online, they've got all of those retro games, haven't they? <laughs> I wonder what... I w Honestly, I wouldn't mind them going back to cartridges, but I suspect that wouldn't be very... um, Like, big cartridges, not like not the small ones. I suspect they're going to stay with the like little SD, uh, SD card um, size. Mm, so I was wondering about VR digits, but I think that that might be a little bit... We're just killing time at the moment, if anyone's wondering what we're doing. We're just killing time, sneaking around. Um, yeah, change the media format compared to earlier generations. I think that it will be little, uh, little cartridges. Yeah, I thought that maybe... It would be VR or, um, oh, I might have to leave the screen. Is it nighttime already? It's mid, still mid-morning. Mid -morning. I'm just trying to, um... Yeah, kill kill time and I might as well train my sneak skill and lower my stamina so that I can rest for longer. Uh, or I was thinking maybe they might do the kind of combine the Switch and the Wii U and do the old double screen thing again, like they did with the DS, that you can play a game on TV, but you get separate screen in lap. Um and find some way to make that portable. I don't know. Yeah, they're the uh, Virtual Boy, right? Made everyone sick. I didn't know whether they might go for something um, uh, kind of like the 3D, 3DS route or VR route or something like that. Know where the Herbless Ring is, can give you a hint if you want. No, no, I won't have a hint. No. The temptation flickered across my face. No, I, I will, I, I will suffer. I am suffering, all right? This is, suffer for my art. We are going to sneak all day. We're going to do it legit. This is the Wii U was such a successful console. That's true. I think that, especially considering it would be coming off of another successful console, I think it would be a mistake. Um, make it too much like the Wii U. So I hope they come up with a different name that isn't just the fucking Switch 2. I hope it's not the Switch 2 or the Swatch. Or the Switch Switch. I love suffering and crying. <laughs> just love, love a bit of trauma. Just a little bit of trauma. <laughs> Gives you more memories to stay with you, right? Gives you something to think about before you go to sleep at night. Yeah. Oh, the Switch. That would be funny. <laughs> The switch you. I do need to check that I'm not uh, currently uh, ill. Can I see how much stamina I've got? Magic points. 
let's uh, just let's have a rest. It's the switcheroo, electric boogaloo. PlayStation Two worked well. Why wouldn't the Switch Two? I said I because I just feel like the Wii U didn't go down very well. That I think that they need to make it a like need to make it clear that it's a different console than their Switch. A biz yeah, making playing cards. The ultimate switch up. Switch 3D. I used I loved the 3D on the 3DS. Mm, the bad marketing for the Wii U. Yeah, maybe if they did it a bit better this time. Mm. The switch attach. Oh, how interesting. And it would be like. Oh, I wonder. Switch attach. I wonder if you could attach it to your face for VR. So with the Wii U, as I understand it, the marketing made it seem like it was just the Wii. With an extent, like an extension of the Wii. A lot of people thought that they were just buying the um, uh, tablet thing. And they would be able to use it with their Wii. Um, I remember that being a thing at the time. I don't know if that was necessarily the whole failure of it. Mm, the whole motion control thing, yeah. I've always said that I think um, the Wii's motion control kind of pioneered VR a little bit as well because it let you... Like, obviously not, not necessarily VR, but, you know, it kind of let you interact with games in your space, like home space. Hmm. Yeah, handheld, like PlayStation Portable, but didn't wasn't really portable enough, though, because you couldn't take the Wii U out. A foldable one? Oh, wow. That would be wacky, wouldn't it? Maybe it could have, you know, I was saying about the dual screen thing, maybe it could have a flip-up screen on it. I don't know. I would say no, just because the Switch and the the Steam Deck are very different. Um, I suppose it would pose a, a competition um, in terms of they're both um, portable gaming consoles, so you might only take one. But uh, I think I'm leveling up, right? Stealth. 20. All right, we're well, Stealth 20, and we'll keep an eye. Um but the games that you play on the Switch are not necessarily games that you'll be able to access on, like, PC. Like the new Atlas game. Atlas Vanillaware game. That I can't stop thinking about now, since you guys mentioned it. So... <laughs> I'm trying to get through other games first, though. Unicorn Overlord. Yeah, I liked my Wii U. I thought my Wii U was great. Like Wind Waker uh, Remaster. Really enjoyed it. Coming from someone who hadn't played Wind Waker before. So I wasn't coming from a place of thinking this game didn't need to be remade. Um, it's midday. Good. We've made it away from mid-morning. Tw still 20 level. Still level 20 for stealth. But... Oh, move from screen to screen. Okay. Can do that. So make the game go a bit faster. Kind of like StarCraft. Oh yeah, like Fire Emblem. I loved Fire Emblem Three Houses. If we made it go too much faster, we wouldn't be suffering as much. Mm. Yeah, it's true, Yasu. And I love my 3DS. I always used to use the 3D. I was like, oh, just turn it off. No, I want to feel like I'm inside the game. <laughs> and you can take 3D photos of people. Amazing. Uh, right, let's have a look. Stealth 22. 
Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. It is working how we wanted it to. Yeah. And I think they could have made three houses look much nicer as well. If it was on a more powerful console. Like some of the tech, like, oh, like you look at the textures and you're like, Ugh. you know, it's like one of those things that you don't want to look too close at. <laughs> it's really ugly. Yeah. Yeah, it prints money and it burns money. And they seem to go in a bit of a cycle with it. But I suppose the GameCube, well, how successful was the GameCube? I never had one. Um, the Wii was super successful. Uh, the N64 was super successful, right? I've got to keep an eye on my stamina. Oh, we seem to be fine. Not super successful. Okay, so did it go Nintendo 64 successful? GameCube not successful. Wii successful. Wii U not successful. Switch super successful. Um, so we're looking for another dip. We're looking for another shit console then. Oh, so is mine gluten-free. Where did yours break? Mine's broken on the hinge. I'd like to get myself another one. But I remember looking like way before COVID at new ones and I was like, ooh, you know, they're a bit expensive. I'll buy one, you know, later. And I'm looking, I look at them now and I'm like, ooh, they've gotten even more expensive. <laughs> it was successful enough. Cheap to make so they could sell a console with two. Oh, yeah, yeah. Still be making a profit. That was the first console with Animal Crossing on it. Two, two right? Mm. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people have uh, a lot of good memories of the GameCube. A lot of people will say the GameCube was my favorite. Mm. Oh, the N64 way below Nintendo's expectations. I guess it was coming out at the same time as... Was the PlayStation out? It was the original PlayStation, right? I didn't have an Nintendo 64. Still at 22 for my stealth, but maybe I'm... Yeah, between the PlayStation 2, PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2. We, my dad got me a PlayStation 1. Years after it came out, I think. Um, I don't know where he got it. He just he bought it home one day. We I, we weren't expecting him to bring it home or anything. Um, to go faster. Will it make him walk faster? Oh, we're mid-afternoon though. We're nearly at evening. Because then I'll forget. Oh, uh, hang on. If I go one, two, three. Right. I put it up three. So I'll put it back down afterwards. Where's he stuck? Better thing he seems to be going bloody slower. Yeah, I found a stray PlayStation 1, gave it a nice home. It feels like that. It was the um, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. Like, I think it came with the Harry Potter and Philosopher's Stone. Um, with it, or maybe my dad got it separately. I don't know if they were sold together or whatever. Yeah. And the thing about Nintendo games is they never go down either. It's still fucking expensive. I thought it was a VCR. That's so funny. Where do I put the... Where do I put the videotapes? Right, I've put it up six. Hmm. You thought you got one. Did you have to, like, give them anything for it? Or were you just... Is it time yet? Mid afternoon still. If these fucking fairies don't show up at night, can I? All right, lads. I know I said I want to help. I am asking. Can I? It, are these fairies gonna show up at night? Just so I have not wasted like they are. I was right. Oh dang! Now I wish I hadn't asked because it would have been a nice surprise. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, great. Because I just realized how much suffering we would have gone through. I am pressing plus, by the way. I've put it up 10. 10 pluses. Don't call them fucking fairies. Lovely, beautiful, wonderful fairies. Budimus fairies. Yeah. What did you put in chat, Lost? Did you put a, you put a link in chat? What are you linking? What are you linking? You put it in Discord. Discord. 
It'll just be awkward, they are. <laughs> I'm gonna sneak around in here and then change um, screens. Oh, okay. Oh, it was my tip. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Try to advertise it, Lost. <laughs> thank you. No, no, no worries. No, it doesn't look faster. I wasn't even using numpad. I was using the... I was uh, just using the normal one. Mm. Being right is a nice surprise. That's true. I suppose patience is also a virtue, so it would have shown my amount of a massive amount of patience that I've got. Barb there should have the faster option. How far are we away from afternoon? Let's switch screens and see whether we've snuck around as well. It might also be control plus rather than just plus. Mid-afternoon. Stealth is still at 12. Oh, we might be able to rest too, though. So after the mushroom circle, we will have all of the ingredients. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. pretty well Alundra it's going all right we are uh, uh it's not very glorious right now I'll be honest um what we're doing is uh we're killing time a little bit we are training off our sneak skill and we're killing time for some fairies to appeal appear yeah I know I'm still only at 22 of the sneak I had thought that maybe it would go up a little bit faster but it's all right it's all right it gives us more time to talk about nintendo <laughs> oh dear alundra what do you think the next nintendo console is going to be i think it's going to be the switch 2 god i still miss club nintendo as well I know they were like, oh, we're going to be, um, don't worry, guys. We're going to replace Club, Club, Ninten Club Nintendo with something just as good. They didn't. <laughs> they didn't. They replaced Club Nintendo with a coin system that you can only um, get the platinum coins that are actually worth anything by getting Nintendo online, right? Sunset approaches. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At 23. Nice. Nobody's going to hear us sneak it now. I remember when Club Nintendo was shutting down, I hadn't, um, like, I didn't know that Club Nintendo was a thing, so I hadn't, um, like, redeemed any of my club nintendo points so i had all of my like nintendo consoles to redeem i ended up get thousands of points it was such a good day best day ever redeeming all of them and sit like browsing oh what do i want to what do i want to get with my nintendo points i think it's just red when it goes up a stat i think it's to show it's like gone up does our stamina go up as well when we, like, we're kind of leveling up our stamina the more we, more we sneak to. Mmm. Yeah, should have changed stats, okay. Got all of the pain of King's Quest, but not as many of the soft locks, so that's pretty good. You regenerate your stamina faster than using it. Oh, nice! We're gonna be so fucking sneaky. We robbed that old lady earlier, and we robbed the sheriff as well. Oh, really? You don't need Nintendo Online to get the coins. Gold are given out when you buy something on the eShop and basically cash back. Do they... What about if you don't buy it on the eShop? What about if you buy it hard copy? Do you not get anything? 
you know, I remember when um, Nintendo started selling their games on like an eShop. I was so confused about why they weren't cheaper. Like to me, games should be cheaper on the eShop because they're not having to manufacture the uh, like the clamshell or the cartridge or anything. I suspect it's not unique. Um, not a unique opinion, right? Hey, Cisco. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, I feel like they're saving money by you using the eShop. That's why if I get a chance, I'd rather buy a hard copy than um, on the eShop, I guess. All right, let's see whether we're at... I don't know whether it's going to be midnight or just, just night time. Hmm... Oh, can be manually registered for a small amount of gold coins. <laughs> Nintendo will throw some gold coins to the peasants. <laughs> That's good to know, though. I had no idea that you could register them. Kind of like Club Nintendo, I guess. Why would they make you manually register them, though? They Surely they know you own them because you put them into your Switch. We've still only got 14 health points, which is a bit of a shame. We might be able to rest as well. Um, too impatient to rest, right? Let's sneak off screen and then sneak back. And what can you get with the gold coins? Is it um, the like fun Club Nintendo stuff? Or is it just kind of nothing? Because I thought the platinum coins were for the good stuff. <laughs> What did Nintendo recently shut down? Was it a Joy-Con um, company? Mmm. Yeah. Will you be able to sell it? I presume you'd be able to sell it, but maybe they wouldn't be able to register it to their account. Oh, count this money off when you buy something on the eShop. I suppose that's nice. I just, I, I liked the, like, exclusive um, Club Nintendo merch. <laughs> 2.5 million out of the last one. Yeah, I think Nintendo shut down some kind of Joy-Con. Um, something to do with Joy-Cons, I think, recently. I can't, I don't know. It might be an emulator, I'm not sure. I didn't read too much into it. Ah, oh, platinum coins are used for the exclusive merch. They rarely have anything more than crappy keychain. Oh. I remember Club Nintendo, they used to have, like, statues. Um, I got my year of the Luigi coin. And uh, I remember getting the soundtrack. I've got the soundtrack of um, Smash Brothers. And the soundtrack for Mario 3D World. Oh, the Yuzu emulator is... Did they have Joy-Cons as their logo? Because it was something something with a jo uh, Joy-Con. Like, I saw an image. Oh, yeah, Club Nintendo was so good. It felt like an actual reward scheme for purchasing Nintendo items. Rather than... Nothing, I guess. Ah, I see. They were making money off of it. I suppose, I guess they could argue that they were breaking even. They weren't necessarily making money, but... Yeah, it looks like two Joy-Cons. Okay, that's what I saw. Ah, oh, one year in the US, two years in Europe for the register of games. Registration is only for gold coins. Registration is done through the game icon on the Switch homepage. I wonder then. I don't buy that many games, but... I wonder if I... <laughs> I'm going to go and register all my games now. We're still at Stealth 23. Okay. A Zelda Picross game for 3DS that was great. I wonder how much it's worth now. I have the uh, gold Game & Watch game for DS. And I regret taking it out of its plastic. Um, so I didn't take it out of the, the clamshell, but I took it out of the plastic... Um, like the thin plastic that goes over the clamshell. 
Mm, old re game registration cards in PC big boxes, but a little bit more modern, yeah. I mean, I guess it's nice that they give you something. Some gold coins. It sucks you can only use it on. <gasps> oh, looky, a human. What's it doing here? Hello. Yuck. Let's have some fun with it. Humans? Why is it always humans? Go away. You can't play. I think it wants to play with us. Oh, please. I hope I should have saved. How do you dance? Oh, hang on. I can save. Will you dance for us? Then dance for us. Humans can't dance. Let's see you dance. I bet you can't dance. Dance for us. All he wants to do is dance. Let's see you dance. I can dance. You want me to dance in the middle of the... Can I stop fucking sneaking, please? Oh, look at us go. Ooh, it does know how to dance. Wow, wee, this is neat. Gee, I didn't think it could do this. Well, I just love it. You love an Antwerp. Do not do too. What? Oh, wow. So, what do you want? Why are you here? Do you suppose it's hungry? What do humans eat? Fairies! Fairies? Everyone knows humans eat animals. Yuck! But what are you bothering us for? Why do humans why don't humans ever answer? What is all this about? Uh. Fairy dust is very magical. Is that why you're here? Why should we give you any dust? You it danced for us, didn't it? Well, I say we give it some dust. That's because you have a crush on it. Do not! Dewdrops in love with a human. Am not. Are too. If you love it so much, you give it some. Ick, not me. You. You. No you. No way you. Not me, you. Make Mikey do it. Mikey! Alright, alright. But you over me. Alright, human. Hold out your hand and close your eyes. You will get a big surprise. You hold out your hand. What else could you do? No peeking. I think it's cheating. Oh, just give it some dust. As the fairy dust sifts through your fingers, you realize that you need something to put it into. <gasps> oh, I cry. I needed something to put it into. Oh, get out. I need it. Oh my god. We d we did all of that sneaking. No, I need the water. I need the water. The water we need. Drink the water? But we need that water. We can get more. I suppose we can get more. That isn't drinkable. I'm checking the guide. I'm checking the guide to see if there's any way around this. Water. <sighs> Wait until midnight. Go to the mushroom ring. You'll see little cute fairies dancing around. They'll tell you to dance. Agree to dance. After you finish, ask them about things. Fairies, dryad, dust. So you ask them about dust, they'll give you some. Make sure you have an empty flask to put it in. Where can I buy? I need two flasks. They'll give me more later. Oh, this is the this is the worst. Uh, I'm just gonna ask them about the stuff as well. This is boring. Is that all you care about? Shall we dance again? What about the human? Maybe if we ignore it, it'll go away. Oh. 
We are magic. We make rainbows. We dance. We sing to make the colors. We are the prettiest things in the world. We just want to have fun. Fa fairies live in the forest. I didn't bring a... S I didn't buy a healing potion. Can I sleep inside the fairy circle? While you were asleep, something decided to make a meal of you. Okay. You know what? I'm just... I'm going to restore a mushroom. Restore a mushroom. We lost all of our stealth that we spent ages getting, but it's fine. It's cool. It's fine. You know what? No, 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 no. It's not fine. It's not, it's not okay. We're gonna, we're gonna restore. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Never understand. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sek. Thank you. Oh dear. Spider. Welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in. You've come in at a moment of failure for me. So, <laughs> welcome in. How was your stream? How was Ultima? How are you getting along in it? Welcome in, welcome in, lads. Lads, if you like retro games, <laughs> may I recommend someone who's better at them than I am? Spider's a wonderful streamer. And start. Oh, shit. Hang on, sorry. <laughs> sorry, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Just one moment. One moment, please. <laughs> Star drop. <laughs> oh, God, it's really chasing me. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Oh, dear. This is terrible. So, I, um, I spent an hour trying to get these fairies to appear. They then appeared, gave me their dust. I didn't have anything to put the dust into, so it just fell onto the floor. It just went onto the floor. Look, he's not touching- you are not touching me. He's not touching me. It just fell onto the floor, and now I can't complete the magic potion. So now I've got to go find a flask. Oh my god, please, sir. <laughs> please leave me alone, sir. Please let me leave. <laughs> so welcome in, Raiders. This is, uh, this is, um... Uh, this is Quest for Glory. This is Quest for Glory. And I'm Captain Badgertail. I'm gonna cry. So I hope you had a good stream. How was Ultima? You know what? We're just gonna go up here. We're just gonna go. We're just gonna restore the game. We're gonna restore it. We're gonna pretend it's not there. No, I don't think I'm good enough to kill it. <laughs> We could dance for them, but I think we'll just run away. Oh, can I just sneak through the forest? I'm a little bit concerned that they're gonna kill me. Oh no. I think they're gonna force me to dance. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. Now bonus rocks and dirt mixed with my fairy dust. Oh yeah. Makes it more powerful, makes it taste better as well. What's our name? It's Badger, right? But like, do we have a can canonical name? Was being a bit silly. There may have been some cheating. A little bit of pumpkin eating. Don't worry. I'll look the other way if you look the other way that I, I have a walkthrough up as well. Oh, just Hero? I think Hero would be a good name for a child, right? This is my child hero. Got great expectations for them. Yeah, I could sleep and get some free food. Um, I think... Oh, 
You said sneaking. You told me to sneak and I snuck. And now I'm dead again. This is the worst. Oh no, the fairies. No, please let me leave. Just please, I... This because my sneak stays low. the worst replace hey Arthur Arthur everything's going wrong I say we just run because what's better than sneaking just just running away right, hang on if we pause for a sec so I can have a look at my map We need to go buy a health potion. Well, the health potions were really expensive. That's why I didn't buy one. Um, we are in, we're up from the Gobbo area. If we go to the, we go. I think the Dryad tree, if we go down, 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 and then to the right. I think the dryad tree is safe. Oh god. Find me. Oh yeah, bravely run away. I keep wanting to call him Graham. He gives me Graham vibes. I know from like King Graham. Um, if we go down, this is the mushroom circle. Yeah, that's very nice. Thank you. Lovely to see you guys again. Yep. It's wonderful. Right. If we go down. Hey, Jeb, good morning. Oh, Devon is a canon name. It comes with Quest for Glory, the authorized guide. Devon Aidendale. That's kind of fun. Oh my God, I'm dancing again. <laughs> Thank you. Dancing does increase my stats. Which stats does it increase? What, my health points, I think, it, right? Can I just dance all night? Should we just keep going? Increases riz. Should we just riz these fairies all night? Many days grinding stats and sweeping leaves to get money and stamina. Sweep leaves. Maybe we'll grind dancing for a bit. There's agility and vitality. We could probably use both of those. <laughs> Don't know what you're talking about. How long is this game, lads? Out of interest. Not that I'm like trying to hurry through it. God, I wish it was finished. No. <laughs> Um, <laughs> how long is it though? On oh, like, uh, not that I, not that I'm hoping to finish it super quickly. Just curious. It's 500 points long. Not long if you know what you're doing. What about for me? Where did my? Bit long, long question. Crash. All right. So like, like eight hours ish, maybe ten hours. I suppose we'll probably take ten. have a look at what our stats are like. Stamina is going up as well. 38 for stamina. Intelligence, vitality. All right, let's dance. We'll dance like a few more times and then we'll go. Oh, it's going great, Onionish. It's going great. We haven't died at all. And um, there are some panthers that look like men, but also like horses. I think they'd make great cereal mascots. It could take a while. <laughs> At least the music's good. Da, 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 da. Oh, I couldn't speed up. Um, look at pause, turn, master, and normal animation, slower, faster animation.
But I'm sorry I said war. Oh, there we go. We're going, lads. We're motoring. <laughs> I don't know why it keeps saying you'll be sorry you said that. they keep saying that it's like it's a little bit creepy it feels like ken williams is talking to me oh because the dance animation is so long right Make sure we're not gonna run out of stamina and die. Night is still young. We're doing okay. Death by dancing with the fairies, honestly. Not the worst way to go. I'd rather dance with the fairies to death than get killed by the man panther. <laughs> the man panther centaur. The manthers. Battle <laughs> on the dance floor. Uh, the Snuggly, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Let's uh, let's save while we're here as well. Save. <laughs> wow, we're gonna have to now. I can't get him to dance. <laughs> I, I was trying to get him to dance while I was going up, but he wasn't having it. He wasn't having it, sect. I'm sorry. And Sledgecore, thank you very much for the follow. Yeah, it wouldn't let me. There we go. Now you're gonna have to imagine it. Cause I know as soon as if, if I replay it, it won't do it at the right time either. <laughs> right, let's save while we're here then. Game save. Um, I'm getting tired. Okay. Oh dear. Is the game broken? Oh no. Uh, it doesn't look like our vitality went up. Our stamina might have done. We'll rest here. I just wanted to, I wanted to take a nap actually. Oh, if I go again, bloody hell. Are we gonna go again or, uh... okay. Can I please rest? Middle of the night, day four. Right, we could try and make it to we're at the mushroom uh, circle, right? If we go in normal animation. Ah, right, I think I've reset it. If I go left. Right, I think I can sleep here.
you sleep comfortably well in this quiet and protected corner of the woods. I love how when I sleep, it looks like I've just like melted onto the floor. Okay, lovely. Right, now, let's have a look at our stats. Uh, still 21 health points, stamina points, uh, 38 out of 38. Uh, we did get 23 stealth. Um, our agility is 41, but I'm not certain it might have already been that high before. We'll start running. Uh, we are trying to make it back into town so we can purchase a health potion. Because I do need the health as well. So, yeah, it kind of makes sense. Right, if I go right from the mushroom circle, I go right again. Uh, down. Down, right. Oh, we could work at the stables. We could. Remember that guy that was, yeah, 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 yeah. It was like, do you like horses? We could go and work at the stables to get some, oh, this is what I wanted to do. Uh, to get, yeah, a little bit more strength. This should breathe heavy. <laughs> oh, dear. You feel some roots touching your feet. Oh. Go up, please. There we go. Let's get that health potion and then maybe we'll go work at the stables. You know, just for some fun. Uh, I think the witch is the one that sells the health potions. Right. I'll go around here. Uh, no, this wasn't the way. <gasps> Sasudio! Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in. Let's go this way. Maybe it's just around. There we go. There's that old lady I robbed. <laughs> I will not sell such things. You will not need to use the word health in this game. Healing potions? Ah, lovely. Right, how much money did that cost me? Uh, no, it did only seem to be coming out of this ear for me. Um. Ah, I've got 220 silver coins. Drink. Healing. Potion. Right, we should have a flask now. My inventory. Flask! Empty flask! <laughs> flask! Okay, let's go to the... Let's go to the stables because we've got time to kill now until... Um, until fairy time. Uh, let me just check where the... I think I know where his house is. I don't think I need to check. I think I know where it is. I'm going to trust myself. I think it's this way. Oh, you know, I could have just bought a flask as well. I just, I've just caught out of the corner of my eye that there was a, uh, there was a flask. It's fine. Hello. Are you speaking to me? Yes. Can I come in? Um. Open gate. Very well. He's not a very good guard. He doesn't take a lot of convincing. Horseman! Your back needs some work, yes. Right, off we go. Uh, 
I like that this is uh, partially the King's Quest music as well. Na, 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 na. Or is that the um, Space Quest music? Was that it? Come, come on over here. The first game I got for my first computer, floppy disk, Jive. Did he give me money? What did he just say? Haven't you got anything better to do to hang around here? Come back some other time if you want to get rich. Okay, he gave me five silver. Okay, sure. Sure, 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 sure. Rob man. <laughs> Threaten man. Uh, let's have a look at all. So we've got 23 strength now. We've got 35 vitality. Uh, we've got an extra health point by the look of it. 31 now. Um, I also did have some questions to ask them. I wanted to ask about the, the quests. Oh, it came with both five and a quarter and three and a quarter sets of discs in the box. That's cool. Did it come with any fun, like, um, fun extras in the big box? Wrong side of that. <laughs> it's not our place to answer questions. Okay. Um, because remember, they won't let me in as well. No one enters the castle without the Baron's permission. So that's why we've got to kind of hang around outside. Um, we could kill time again by sneaking around by the mushroom circle. That sounds great for everyone else. This might be our only option. Um, right, so we've done that. We're coming down past the healer heart. Yeah, we could sneak around if I put the... Uh, animations up, it won't be too bad. Mm. Who's chosen a class that isn't a fighter? Really? I just love the- Ooh! Okay, hang on, lads. Hang on. Pause all thoughts. I love the ideas of- uh, the idea of robbing people. <laughs> I really re got a lot out of robbing that old lady and the sheriff. Um, and then magic just seems to be useful, right? Should we go talk to this guy? You talking to me? Oh, uh, uh. Show a thief sign. Bruno nods and makes a counter sign. You need to talk to Sneak about the password. You can find him in the alley at night. Oh, I'm already a member. Oh, oh well, I, th I thought he'd like to see my verification. Thief Guild License. Maybe if I show. Take spell license? I don't have to spell bloody license. Um Lie. I did spell license right, okay. Um Oh can you rob one more person? It can soft lock the game. What if you rob something? Um Oh, did I spell it British rather than American? Thank you, Mark. How do, how, how do Americans spell license? <laughs> Show. On, if I F3. Show. Thief. Guild. I spelled thief wrong. I before E except off C. Guild. Lie. Lice. I'm not sure what I'm trying to do either, game. Look, I just wanted to show this man that I'm a bona fide thief. <sighs> I 
I just wanted him to respect me, all right? Fellow thief. What's in it for me? You give me a silver I have a bit info you can use. Do we actually want to give him a silver? Steal from him? <gasps> yeah. I'm a bonus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that's how to show him I'm a thief. I always name my character Batman because the little posy makes. Amazing. Game came with a regular manu manual, a hero journal, and the famous Explorer's Correspondence course. Oh, that's super cool. Oh, I miss big box games. I just, I wish they still made the boxes so cool. Here's my crime ID. <laughs> my crime ID. Mm, if you're familiar with three and four, are three and four better for fighters? Um, I don't know if I want to give him a silver. I have got so much money, though. Should I give it? I'll give him a silver. I just don't want to look at the manual. Yeah. Instruction manuals are for nerds. For another silver, I can tell you about where to find the Baron Bubba Yaga and some cowboys that have a lot of treasure. If you want some information, hand me some cash. Well, you didn't tell me what I wanted to know. With the one silver that I gave you. Lydia, good morning. I have no idea what's going on in this game, but I love it. It's amazing. It is, um, so, we're just a random man. We're just a random man who loves adventures. And we, we saw an advert needing an adventurer. And we were like, yeah, I could be that man. Um, so we're here. Mr. Wes. Mr. West, thank you very much. Thank you very much for gifting us up, Lydia. Lydia, where are the weenies? Thank you very much, Mr. West. I'm just a random innocent man who likes to rob people. Very innocent. So don't check my pockets. I robbed an old lady and it was very exciting. It's titillating. <laughs> it's very exciting. I robbed an old lady and I robbed the sheriff. I took all of his most valuable items and his wife's most valuable items as well. Jive Turkey, thank you very much for the follow. Thank you. Welcome in. I'm a graduate of hero school. It's hero time. Is he gonna tell Baron's daughter? I gave you a silver. Please. I've already paid you. I've been scammed. This is, they say, never, like, never give anybody any money when they ask for it because they always come back and ask for more. <sighs> He's a So upset. I'm going to attack him. <laughs> Actually, no, you know, yeah, I can, I can just reload an I Love Crime attack. I'm not, well, I want to attack that man. Stab, use dagger? Stab man with dagger? Oh. What was his name? Bruno. Kill Bruno. Get out of my face! <laughs> Why don't you leave me alone? I ain't done nothing. Other than steal my money, Bruno. God. Hi, I'm just trying to make a buck. No need to give me a hard time. You look nervous. Why don't you take a walk and kill off? Bug off. Ask Bruno for my back. Give me dough, you know. <laughs> I think I think I hear your mama calling you. Actually, she's calling me. We had a great time last night. Um, your boots untied. Maybe you should bend down and tie it up for me, then, Bruno. All right. Don't worry. I had a I had a save of I Love Crime. So we will uh, restore game, restore I Love Crime, and we're one silver richer, and honestly, a lot happier as well. How did he know about my boot? How did he know about my mum as well? <laughs> right, let's go see some fairies. Uh, down. He kills you if you walk away. 
Oh dang, I kinda wanna see him murder me. Hang on, lads. Lads, I need to see I need to see Bruno kill me. <laughs> Sorry. I just hello, kill Sorry, Bruno. This this book this is bordering on harassment, really. Right. Seduce Bruno. Smooch Bruno. It takes too long to draw your weapon against someone with a dagger in his hand. It doesn't pay to try and fight someone who uses poisoned daggers. Alright. Why didn't I kill him? Oh, you know, Bruno's too... He's, he's too just muscular and... Uh, small. He's got a high IQ. He saw me coming at him with the knife and he, you know, moved out of the way. He's a stem-minded individual. Let's get running. Yeah. He's just too cool, you know? He's he's such a cool thief. He did. He spent a night one night with my mother. <laughs> Bruno thinks he's all that. And he sounds like a goblin. I like you, mum. <laughs> God. <laughs> Worst voice yet? <laughs> Propose to Bruno. Am I trying to tell tell you that Bruno's better than... Yeah. Well, you know. It's not worth hiding the truth, right? Right. Midday at five. Let's get sneaking. Let's save. It's sneak o'clock. Snack. It's fine. All right, let's put up the the action uh, faster animation. Faster animation. Let's put it up by four. You know, be a bit more conservative. <laughs> I think we always wake up in the morning when we sleep, and I, sleeping is just wasted time that we could be using to train ourselves. You know. You think Bruno wastes time sleeping? Bruno, he trains. Bruno's like a Dragon Ball character. Bruno is Goku. This music's quite nice. Sometimes I worry when the music gets too nice, I worry that it stops being copyright free and I have to check and no, then it's fine. <laughs> I worry that we've gone off the copyright free um soundtrack I was listening to. You see this walking towards you in the middle of the night. What do you do? <laughs> we do want our sneak skill to be pretty high because it means that we won't get um get killed by those man panthers. Man panther centaurs. <laughs> but sometimes the music just get it, like it it just doesn't feel like it's copyright free anymore it's very good though but this is very good yeah you wouldn't see that pro self move that's no. inconspicuous <laughs> uh, our stamina is up a little bit maybe stealth is still 23 Is no one around and my phone's dead? <laughs> Your phone's only dead because he killed it. Why does he walk like that? Because he's sneaking. No, no, no. I don't need a fight. We're a lover, not a fighter. Bruno taught us that. He taught us that when he visited, when he visited our mom. Oh, dear. Mm-hmm. Yeah, thinking it was King's Quest. There's no Graham. I do miss Graham. Graham was a hunk. Fully rendered arms. A real sense of moral integrity. Graham never moved like this. What's... 
We are going to be here for a little, little bit. Mm, I reckon they are. In the, is there any evidence to say they're not in the same universe? Feels like they would be. Sneaky, sneaky. I'm tempted to put the animation up again, but midday, we're putting it up. Uh, faster. One, two. Oh! <laughs> Are he and you same bolt here? Look at this go! Fuck! No! <laughs> He's got the zoomies. <laughs> He's like Sue's after a piece of fucking cheese. Meow. <laughs> oh no, I caught. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No, we're running. Stop running. Please. I just want you to sneak. We'll just do laps. CBT sonicking around, waiting for fairies. Feel like pure shit, just want the fairies to come out. If our sneak skill doesn't go up, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Do a fucking sob. Gotta sneak fast. It's the time. Midday, Still, it's still only midday. You see that? 26? Oh, yeah. Everyone in the Thieves Guild is going to be so jealous of me. And I'm going to be like, oh my god, how did Badge get so good at sneaking? Wow. Spent my days training in the forests. You know, back in my day, we used to walk five miles. We used to sneak five miles up a hill in five feet of snow. Yeah. They're never going to see me again. I'm too fast. I'm too fast and I'm too sneaky. Oh, did you hear her? I need a poo. Please, father. Save me. I need a shit. <laughs> Dear. Wasn't there a... John... I... I... <laughs> I've seen John Sienna naked. Senna. John. I don't, I've never said his name before. Maybe I have said his name and you guys laughed at me. Because I always say it's Sienna. But it's not. I think the last time we said this, you you guys all laughed at me. Cena. John Cena. He was at the Oscars naked, wasn't he? I don't have anything to say else other than that. That was. It's just a statement, to be honest. Because they always say, here is John Sienna. I don't watch, I don't watch boxing. Uh, right, we're still at stealth uh, 26. Stamina point still at the same. Wrong side of 40. Um, <laughs> the Italian actor. <laughs> it's mid-afternoon now, though. I don't think it was mid-afternoon before. All I saw was an empty stage. Because he, he does the, you can't see me, right? I had to have that meme explained to me. <laughs> Has he been in anything? Like, does he do any acting like The Rock? Hey, Ibrex, good morning. Or is he, um... Has he become popular again because of the meme? Oh, he's in the Marvel series? Peacemaker. Yeah, The Rock does, um, The Rock does, uh, he was in The Mummy. As the Scorpion King. That was his best role that he's ever done. He's Peacemaker. So he, uh, who is Peacemaker? <laughs> I 
fucking grandma. You're a whippersnappers, Christian. You watch as a peacemaker. Christ. You see anything like Captain America? <laughs> oh, he's a DC. Okay. Yeah, it was amazing, wasn't it, Sect? Oh, Fast and Furious? Because he's family. Yeah, DC, not Marvel. Okay. So he's like Captain America, but he's friends with Batman instead of um, Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> Feel fucking ancient. I don't hear about any Captain America movies coming out. Has there been one recently, kiddos? I only watch movies with my favourite Chris in them, Chris Pratt. Oh, he's a villain? Oh, I thought a Peacemaker was a gun, is it not? I, I swear I've um, played a video game where you would get a Peacemaker and it's a gun. Oh, Chris Pratt voices Captain America? I always knew I liked him. He's a great voice actor, isn't he? He did so wonderfully in that Mario movie. His Italian accent was on point. Ah, oh, yeah, with the first big revolvers. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, he's an anti-hero that turns hero, kind of like Magneto. Mm. Magneto's a good guy, right? He was good in one of the X-Men movies I saw. Oh. I'm being clapped. Thank you. Better than having the clap. We still, our stealth hasn't gone up. But <laughs> Single action revolver. Oh, a monster wandered by and you hid in the bushes until it passed. Oh my God, I'm so cool now. I can hide from I can hide from monsters. Mm -hmm. What is the clap? I, I don't know if this is really appropriate stream conversation. What is the what is the clap um like chlamydia? Is it like a the street name for chlamydia? No, our stealth goes up when we um just just by using sneak, our stealth goes up. Stiffy sneak <laughs> making me laugh. I feel like Flight of the Bumblebee pissed. Oh, it's gonorrhea. Okay. And gonorrhea is distinctly different from chlamydia, right? Oh, Christ, we're running. Stop, stop, stop. Sneak. Gonorrhea or gonorrhea? Colloquially known as the clap, is a sexually transmitted infection caused oh, by the STI. bacterium Neisseria gonorrhea. Mm, thank you very much, Loss. Science. <laughs> thank you very much, Loss. Yeah, it's really, it's a, you have to be really end of classical music to know Flight the Bubble We Piss. It's a shortened to FBP. Oh, doctors had to clap. Oh, that's so funny. Sorry. <laughs> they had to clap them. Like, I know. You, <laughs> I want to know more, but I don't. Like, just. <laughs> Mid-afternoon. Oh, a stealth is up to 28. That's nice. Like a big old pimple. Oh, right. I see. Fast sneaking and a medical class. Educational stream. I was there. Uh, I'm hoping to take. <laughs> hoping to take over from David Attenborough eventually. You know, as an educational platform for everyone. The last time I googled it, which was when? Was did I ask you to Google it? Dark. I'm at work. Just dropping by to say hi. Dark. Good oh, it's morning. a quest game. It is a quest game. We're waiting for some fairies to turn up. Um, we're waiting for some fairies, and while we're waiting, we are um, 
Oh, I'm getting hungry. Should I eat a ration? We could eat an apple. We could eat a ration. Whatever we fancied, really. We're waiting for some fairies to turn up. We've got to wait until nighttime for them to come. And while we're waiting, we are um, training our sneak skill. Is what we're, what we're hanging about doing. Duh. Thank you. Oh, you're nearly at the wrong side of 40. Duh. Thank you so, so much. Thank you for 39 months. And thank you so much for tier three. How is work going? A clapier is a French name for a house of ill repute. Oh my god. Oh, it lives at the clapier. Let's eat a ration. Oh. What happened to all my rations? Oh. Um, can I eat those mushrooms? Or am I gonna... Can I, can I eat the apples? I shared them with the hermit. This is why you don't share, guys. Can I share, can I eat those apples? Uh. Maybe Bruno took them. No, it's the hermit. Apparently I'd need not enough nutrition to keep you alive, but could be useful in another way. So we might have to pop and go get something to eat. At Aaron's piece. What can I eat? It's quite a way away. We'd have to really run it. Run for it. We can make a run for it. Right. Crap. Stuck. In, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Stuck. Oh, crap. okay. Oh, it. Oh, the fruit. Okay. We need to go a bit slow. Oh my god. King ravaged. Okay. Right. We need to. I just. Need, I just need you to go a bit slower. Thank you. This is Baba Yaga's place. This isn't where we wanted to be. Oh, stop! Please, just. Just, 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 just uh, hang on a moment. Just slow, slow down. Right, we're just gone past the gobos. Gobbo. Right, we don't want to go to, straight up to Baba Yaga. <gasps> Bread, that is cute. Look at that cute little guy. Oh. Oh no. That cute little guy. Are you pleased? Oh. Please, sir. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> this is. Now, I think if we go up, I keep getting caught on the bushes. Right, we're here. And then if we go this way, and then I think straight up. Yeah. Could not escape. Oh, jeez. Nice. Right, let's eat. It was very sweet. This is very talented. And it was quick to approve as well. Or this was um, auto approval. Can I take a fruit? No. All right, don't need another piece of fruit. Right, let's get back down to. Let's go right. Go down. Go down. Down. Ooh, ooh. There's something that I don't recognize down here as well. Oh, it's this guy. The sexy farmer. <laughs> Fuck off. Get out of my way. Ah. Oh. 
They just sped approve at it. God, you know how long it took me to get my first emotes approved? It took them like a month. They are, they are getting quick. That's great though. Like, it's good they've sped up with it. Yeah, back in ye olden days, when I was but a young 76 year old, Ah, oh, this is right. I went... You need to go up from here. They liked it so much they approved it faster. So they didn't like mine. Right, let's uh, let's save as well. As like we've eaten. Uh, we'll just replace this one. I don't see. Oh. Um, let's get back to sneaking, I suppose. Uh, the sunset approaches as well. So we are... Should be soon. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it might be an automated AI. Could be. Yeah, we did save Homer. Don't you worry. Yeah, we've eaten now. We just need to wait for the fairies to come and we will get some of their dust in our jar. Our flask. Oh, put your dust in my jar, fairies. Tingle vibes, eh? <laughs> and then after we'll go to the healer's hut, we'll get that potion made. And what's the potion for? Does anyone remember? <laughs> Does anyone remember what that potion? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, tingle tingle. Thank you so Thank you. What a nice jar you've got. I need your strongest potions. Oh, it was a potion of dispel. What did I need that for? <laughs> what was the reason for me wanting the potion of dispel? Ooh. Don't want to get lost. Oh, the dryad didn't say. Okay, fair. Fair enough. I thought that maybe oh you need a you need to take it there, but I don't want to make us go too fast. Cause I don't want to get another pickle, but <laughs> What year was this put out in, lads? Nineteen Alright, let me get nineteen eighty seven, I think. That's my guess. I'm sneaking. <laughs> it's like me after too much cheese. Ooh. <laughs> Please, I need a shit. Hello, Gams. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. You're here for the absolutely riveting gameplay. Oh, she, Jesus Christ. Okay, hang on. I need, when he's sneaking like this, I need to concentrate to have full control over him. Oh, it's 1989. Uh, expect more from 1989. <laughs> We're waiting for some fairies. Interestingly enough, we need to get, um, we need to get some fairy dust for our jar. Convenient, eh? 1989. This is the same year as Tex Murphy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does Tex Murphy look better? I think it does. A Tex gets away with having pictures of real people, though. Um, I guess it's just different, right? Yeah. No, no, no. We're not. We we did go and do something. We ate some fruit, Hyle. We went. We went and ate some fruit. Um, we raked some leaves, and now we're back to sneaking, waiting for the uh, fairies to turn up. I'm not bad-mouthing them. I'm not. They're very beautiful. Yeah, Tex does have very expressive eyes. <laughs> His eyebrows. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not bad-mouthing them. They're just, I guess, I think they're just different, right? 
Like, they're both pixel. Both pixely. I think maybe text has more colours, I suppose. Or does it, though? Because they use those... For the map, it definitely doesn't. Yeah. Text Murphy does... Ah! <laughs> Crap. Oh, lads. Oh, She haunts my dreams, Roberta. One, two, three, four, five. We'll just put it on five. Oh, look at him go. Yeah, use real actors. Which means that they didn't have to. You know what? Mean Streets is better just purely for that death. <laughs> yeah, save often. Mean Streets better. Mean Streets would never do this to me. They are terrifying. They are. Like, why are they so muscular? <laughs> well, you're dead. <laughs> My, uh, what, um, which King's Quest game is the, uh, Be More Careful redeemed from? Is it King's Quest 6 or 5? One of the two. The forest is their gym. Oh my god, they're gym bros, aren't they? The absolute chads. My sneaky isn't high enough. Oh, it's from four. Four. Yeah. I think the death messages are one of the best bits about the Sierra games. As much as I complain about the deaths. Um, my favorite King's Quest is maybe... So I fucking love Hoot Hoot King Graham. King's Quest 4. Um, which, uh, who was the main character? Was it Graham or was it Alexander in King's Quest 4? Uh, I like Hoot Hoot King Graham because I felt like Cedric is a dreamboat. But I also really like King's Quest 3 because it, it got my heart pumping. You know, that... Um, The time limit. Rosella was King's Quest 4. Oh, yeah. I remember. I remember. <laughs> I don't remember. Look, I don't remember what I ate for breakfast, all right? It's a long time ago that we played King's Quest 4. If you exclamation mark games, you can see how far down the list it is. <laughs> Go check out the list of games we've played if you're interested. Uh, it's not completely up to date. It's up to date as of January this year, which was you know, like three months ago, but kind of so, like close enough, right? Mm, yeah, it was my retro game of the year, it was. Oh, bread. 50-50 though. Oh yeah, digits, yeah. Well, this is my favorite game, my, my favorite screen of the game. We, we've spoken about gonorrhea on the screen. We've spoken about the clap, which is uh, the same thing. Uh, we've spoken about Nintendo's greatest and worst consoles. Um, so, you know, this 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 screen has a lot of good memories for me. I just, I don't want our time here to end. Okay, it's still not night time yet. Gams, what do you think the next Switch is going to look like? <laughs> Decided to ask you about uh, Nintendo rather than Gonorrhea. <laughs> yeah, I liked it. I, I don't know, King's Quest 3 just got your heart pumping. It was uh, timed. And like not knowing whether you're going to make it until that moment was so exciting. Because realistically, playing through the whole game didn't take that long. But if you had to restart because you didn't do it within the time limit. Oh. Was there Virtual Boy? What do you think? I haven't lost. I haven't. We spoke about it when uh, when we were playing it. But I haven't played. I didn't end up getting around to play it. The Virtual Boy. But I feel like the Virtual Boy has its own virtues. 
you know, it pushed forwards VR, I guess. We still own copyright free music. This music doesn't sound copyright. It is. Fine. Oh my god, it's night time. Fairy time. Fairy time. Fairy time. Okay. Uh, right, lads. Calm down. <laughs> Everybody, don't panic. Save. Replace. Right, now we need... Yeah. I've got my jar ready. Oh, fairies, I'll dance for you. If you fill my jar. Dance. Oh, tingle, tingle, I'll dance for you. <laughs> Never forget about Tingle. Tingle visits me in my dreams. 100, welcome in. Oh, it does know how to dance. Wowie, this is neat. Gee, I didn't think I could do this. Well, I just love it. 100, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in, thank you. Tingle was in Legend to Larry. Which one? Which leather suit? Right, I would like some dust, please. Surprised Nintendo didn't sue them. Nintendo does like suing people. Yes. We don't need to read all of this again. No peeking. I think it's cheating. Oh, we'll just give it some dust. You place the dust carefully away in an empty flask. Okay, now we're free. So let's save. Ooh. Wah! Hey, <laughs> USJ. Wah! Who is David? Who did we meet called David? Um, okay. Right. Let's... So we could pop down to the dryad uh, tree and see if we can take a little bit of a nap. That might be uh, worth it. So we need to go down from here. Sneaking's worth it because we might be able to avoid like a nasty encounter say hi to the dryad for us we'll do we'll take a nap at the dryad tree and then afterwards we should head to the healer's hut and then after we've been to the healer's hut we might go get some fruit some juicy succulent fruit slip You sleep comfortably and well in this quiet and protected corner of the woods. You awake as the sun begins to rise. Okay. Uh, I'm actually kind of interested. Stealth is 30. Yeah. Does my sneak increase only when sneaking by something or when using it? Just when using it. So when we were just randomly sneaking around, we were, um, we were gaining our stealth... Um, which it started at 20, before the, the great sneakening. The great sneakening today. We started off with 20 stealth, so... Um, it's pretty... Like, 30 is a big improvement. We have two more health points now. I think we've gained a couple of stamina points as well. Uh, we're very intelligent, which I'm not sure has... A, yeah, you'll ignore the weapon use and the parry. I don't need to parry. We're a third of the way there. Yeah, the sneakening. Sneak gate. We could sneak all the way to the healer's hut, um, which would improve our sneak, um, but it does take longer. 
we will get there a bit slower. Uh, we want to go up one into the mushroom ring and then right, like four. Yeah, yeah it is a bit different to Skyrim. Yeah, we could um, turn it up. Uh, I only want to turn it up by one because I get I get overwhelmed when we're zooming. <laughs> when we're zooming, if we end up meeting a predator, oh run, run. If we're meeting a predator, it means actually we could go the. I think there's a slightly. Nah, mm, I won't go the. Quick way. Yes, thank you. That was quite good timing as well, Gams. Oh shit, where am I? I got taken by the music. Um, I think I'm still fine. No, I'm not. Well, I might be all right. Thank you. <laughs> I'm a prisoner to the music. Um, yeah, whenever the music changes slightly, I'm like, is this still? Yeah, it's still fine. <laughs> Aren't we all? What's everyone been listening to musically recently? I have um, been listening to Phil Collins. <laughs> Interest in Phil Collins. The new Judas Priest album. Oh, I've listened to Judas Priest before. What kind of music do they do? Ah, you, sir. I think I know who you are. I think if I go... Ah, heavy metal. Oh, that song from Mean Street. <laughs> you could uh, reword that. I've been repeatedly tormenting on it. <laughs> yeah, Phil the Thrill Collins. I am... Um, heavy metal is one of the... Like, I don't... I don't listen to it. I prefer... I like to have songs that I can, like, sing along to. Not that I've got anything against it. I want you to open the door, please. Open the door. Open the door. Open. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Do I like Taylor Swift? Um, I'm not, like, a... Not a big fan. You know, like, I'm not, like... I wouldn't say I'm a... Sw oh, I've got a knock. That makes sense. Sock. Uh, knock. I wouldn't say I'm a Swifty, uh, but I will listen to the odd song every so often. I like um, I like a couple of songs on her Reputation album. Right. Um, I what is there another song that I quite like? Um, oh, hang on. You say to the healer, I've been to visit the dryad of the woods. She gave me a magic acorn and told me the formula for a potion to dispel enchantments. Let's go back to normal. Safe. I tend to like, um, I like listening to the uh, Stardew Valley OST as well. The healer <laughs> yeah, didn't even say anything. They're like, yeah, and what? Place. Yes, we're a thief and a bit of a mage. We we do some, do some spells. I'm sorry, I don't know much about that. Perhaps you should ask someone else. Um, give ingredients, maybe. About dryad. I have heard that that dryad of the woods knows a dispel potion to disenchant people with spells upon them. Oh, should I give them individually? Give magic a... Oh. It's the best possible class? I didn't even know that. <laughs> it was, you know... Just went where my heart took me, and my heart took me to greatness, so. <laughs> Magic acorn. 
So you help the dryad, that's nice. She does keep the forest around here healthy. So that's how to make a dispel potion, isn't it? Thanks for letting me know. Let's see, to make the dispel potion, I still need fairy dust, green fur, flowers from a renner's base, and flying water. The healer, oh, the healer makes some sort of arcane gesture over the floss of water. She just, she... Flying water, how clever. So, you say this is one of the ingredients for the Dispel Potion. Well, I bet get started making it. Ah, uh, I just can't pick, pocket lo pick locks. We did steal a lot from that old lady by picking a lock. Um... Those meeps sound so interesting. I'd like to meet them sometime. I'll get to work on that potion of yours. Thank uh, yeah. I often use flowers from Arena's piece in potion making. Here are your silvers. You put them away. Why does she sound like Bruno? <laughs> they're, they're related. They're twins. They're twins, you know. <laughs> this is not. The dispel potion will take a while, mate. Why don't you come back later? That's how I could fuck. <laughs> I just gave her my medieval peasant voice. Just like <laughs> my basic medieval peasant voice. Um, I don't, I don't have your son so money from us. Oh, well, that's a shame, isn't it? Boys will be boys, you know what Bruno's like. <laughs> Ma'am, your son also stabbed us. <laughs> oh, Christ. Right, um... We've got luck 33, that's good. Good for us. Um, what else am I doing? Uh, let's have a look what we've got. Um, Silicon Mushrooms, we've got our license, our lockpick. Um, while we're waiting, we could go and rake some leaves. Yeah, for this, why did we go rake some leaves? Now, okay. Hang on, let's hang on. I'm going to do something unethical. Please don't judge me. You don't really think that's the correct way to actually win this game, do you? Okay, it didn't let me do anything. Okay. Can I push her? Hey, Scrub Jay, good morning. Why? Oh, I'm just trying to push her. Um. No, all right, we'll leave then. I just had to check. I just had to check. I'll sell for shopping. If I can't shove, I'll sell for punching. She'll tell Bruno if we're not careful. Yeah, hey, I'll set my son on you. Hello. Open gate. Oh, you can never... All right, so what if I ask her to make me that potion and then I steal from her? Oh, maybe she'd play some triple triad, though, as well. Would you like to play this game Hearthstone? Come back here and take a rake. Oh, 
What do we want to do after this, though? So, we've got some time to kill. I don't know when, um... I presume that it's going to take, like, a day for that lady to get her potion ready for us. Um... <sighs> we could have a look on the map and see whether there's anywhere we haven't been to. That might be quite fun. Oh, she buys flowers, mushrooms, and troll beards. Also sells unique potions. Oh, nice. <laughs> I presume we're like mucking out the stables, right? Mm. What day is this? Um, this is Wednesday. <laughs> uh, midday, day six. I'm presuming that I'm not going too slowly. Hoping, not going too slowly. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Roast beef sandwich! Thank you very much. The follow. Amazing name. Roast beef sandwich. Amazing name. Thank you very much. Uh right, if we go back if we go back down. I can't tell if I'm going the right way or not. I wanna Next screen over. Maybe we'll, I thought think maybe we'll check out some places that I don't think we've been to before. Uh, this might be the troll. I don't know if I want to. I don't know if I want to play with the troll right now. Oh no, this isn't where the troll lives. This is just. We do have to find that healer's um, ring as well. Mm. Okay. There. You think that maybe the ring would have been at Arena's piece? You're right at the snow area. I can't at the moment, I don't think. Unless I can climb. Oh my goodness, please. Maybe I run. Can't go right. Unless I can climb. No. no purpose right now. Oh, the one up north. Okay, yeah, I can go up north. Mm -mm. No, don't, don't tell me where the ring is. I'm keeping my peepers peeled, though. Oh. Oh! I... Hello. Oh, please don't murder me. Far from the frost field fares forth this fighter. Hunger has hurled me hither from home. My name is known in the North la Northlands as Braugi. Barter with Braugi barter with blades cat clash or bargain with me. Well bargaining sounds nice. Bargain. Ask about Oh, bargain. Find me some fruit for, for to mellow my meat horn. Gift I will give of a gem that now glows. Jewel from Jontaheim, flare of the frost flame. Fetch me fruit that will fill up my fists. Won't all fruit fill up your fists? It looks like it will take a lot of fruit to fill up those fists. Oh, you got. Yeah, you know what they say about big fists, lads. Okay, yes. Alright, bye bye. I'll find some fruit for you. I need fists of fruit! I think I know where to get some fruit, but I don't know whether that's the fruit that he wants. Right. I've got something I want to... Yeah, big toes. Lots of toe jam. I 
guess you get finger jam as well, right? Oh dear. Oh, go away. This where I wanted to go right? So. Then right again. Oh, Raptor. Ah, ha ha. Hello, we haven't been here before. All right. Let's save fists. A sign appears, it reads Wilco Men Alf Zauberg. <laughs> Another sign appears, it reads Trespassers will be towed. Oh, very funny. Trespassers will be towed. Can I dispel? Oh no, I can just. You feel as though you have just scaled the Matterhorn in full armor. What a climb! After you finally catch your breath, you see that you have reached the rather eccentric looking house that you saw from below. There is an ugly gargoyle above the entrance. Stand fast. He who would enter, uh, he would the wizard see. Oh, well, I didn't. What is your name? What is your quest? Uh. Uh. Um. To save the baron's daughter wrong uh glory 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 sir please no i'll be back i'll be back i'll go back bobby dream house <laughs> yeah where's margo robbie i thought they were gonna make me into a toad because like trespassers will toad Oh, you again! Here come your questions! What is your name? What is your favorite color? Uh, I don't have a favorite color, I like all the colors. <gasps> is this fucking uh, copy protection? It's probably purple or blue, right? Because that's what we're wearing. Is it pink? Because it's a pink fucking house. Pink. What is the thieves' password? What is it? Let me in. That's not the password, is it? Oh, it is Schweinhand. It is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that. Because it was a really wacky one. No thieves allowed. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. Please let me in. Why does he want to let a thief in? <laughs> Hello. Here come your questions. That's my name. Badger. Badger. What's your favorite color? Pink! Whose spell protects the town? The wizards! Wrong. <laughs> I thought he wanted me to <laughs> I thought he wanted me a wizard! Wow! Is it the dryads? Isn't it? Oh, it's Erinus, because it's Erinus' peace, isn't it? For goodness sake. Fine. 
Would I know this if I read the manual? Hello, I'm back. Always <laughs> struggle bussing. No matter how strong you feel at the bottom of the mountain, you're always more exhausted than the last time you reached the top. Oh, Zara told me that. You don't give up easily, do you? Here come your questions. <laughs> what is your name? Badger! What is your quest? Hero! What is the Baron's first name? John! <laughs> Controller! Come in! Thank you very much for the follow. Stefan? Stefan! That is correct! The wizard will now see you! <laughs> Can't try to fight gravity. This room is full of odds and ends and stuff. The wizard must be a real character. Should we rob him or not? I feel like we shouldn't. Yeah. Hello. Well, when you when you play when you play three games a week, you forget what happened. In <laughs> and plus, we haven't played this for two weeks. Wizard. Wizard. Shall we rob him? Look. Everything that's not nailed down, that's what I was thinking. Um. Oh, good luck, Mr. West. Spent plenty of time to forget for anyone. Exact oh, those rooms are forbidden. Please don't send me back. Oh my god. How could we be saved? He told me to go up. I also wanted to rob him though. Can I look at that crystal ball? The ball of light floats magically over the center of the room. Now he's a hunk, isn't he? Silver Fox. I don't know why I'm here either, to be honest. Oh my god! He did he was watching us! Cheese, please! Cheese, grommet! Oh, <laughs> oh you want me to talk to you? No one responds. Please, the least you could do is ask me about something more interesting. Please! <laughs> ask about the Baron. Okay. Do you know the difference between a tree tour and a comma? A traitor has claws at the end of its paws, and a comma is a pause at the end of a claws. Twitch didn't take away the react button. You guys could have been reacting so hard right now. Oh my god, is that me dying, Brad? Or me uh, giving it to him and then him. Do you know what Big Pavlin eats unfair lichtings? My penis! Big purple unfair lichtings eaters! Ha <laughs> ha! Large purple undeer flea licked dingy eaters are all too common in these forests these days. I told you to be more interesting. You may go now.
I bored him. What a rude man, though. What a rude old man. God. You guys want to steal his pension? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Wish I could do that every time I was bored by conversation. <laughs> this is good training. Nice dried fruit. Old men like dried fruit, right? I didn't ask about Zara or Baba Yaga. I just thought he would find the dryad interesting. She's a tree woman. She's a sexy tree lady. Get that stamina up. I wonder if it has. Hello, world famous actor Chris Pratt. Chris. I was very impressed. Mm with the makeup team that made me look like an ancient wizard for this part. I still sounded like Chris Pratt, though. <laughs> yeah! Look, Chris, if you didn't sound like Chris Pratt, how would people know who to praise for a, such a fantastic acting experience, right? Pixels, thank you. Who would they know to? How would they know who to give the Oscar to? If you didn't sound like Chris Pratt, they would have been like, "Wow, Marrow's voice actor did an amazing job." But how would they know who it was? It's branding. Yeah. Chris does like to scream. Ask about Zara. Zara has real flair for the theatric. Her method of greeting customers at her shop is showy but effective. It's a pity she has no sense of humor. Just because she never laughs at your jokes doesn't mean that she lacks a sense of humor. It just means that she has good taste. Ask about... Erina? Never met her. Only built this vacation home here a century ago. Erina has a nice little magical meadow. In her name, northeast of him. Pretty respectable spellcaster, I imagine. The protection spell she cast over the town is fairly good, but I believe she missed a few places. You're just jealous because the only thing anyone named after you was a soft drink. I thought that Erasmus Rootin' Tootin' Beer was wonderful for a product name. It's a shame the company went broke after that. Can I tell him a joke? I wonder if I can tell him a knock-knock joke. Yeah. No one hears you knocking. No. <laughs> no, then. No, I can't. Ask about uh, Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga is good at curses and shape-changing spells. She has a nasty temper, so it's best to stay on her good side. You have to watch her. She cheats at cards. Scoper. So do you. She started it. I just wanted to give her a taste of her own medicine. It's a shame she still beats you. Ha ha ha. You can ruin his jokes by completing them. He hates it. But then he'll kick me out again. You think he seems like he played triple triad, not Hearthstone. I think he'd like the... <laughs> I think he'd like playing as Gina Proudmoore. Garrosh versus Jaina. Now, is there anything else I should ask him? Or, um... Ask about curse. Oh, it's a good idea. Curse and then spells as well. It would be best to wait until Erasmus puts down his cup of tea before asking any more questions. Okay. Oh my god, put it down, old man. <laughs> the curse Baba Yaga placed on the Baron von Spielberg was a fine example of creative cursing. Upon von Spielberg and all his clan, this curse now, curse I now demand. What I will shall come full measure, so shall ye lose all that ye treasure. Of course, the problem is that for every curse there is an equal and opposite. Counter curse. A counter curse is the curse for a curse. 
He totally works against the one who cast the curse in the first place. The counter curse for the curse on the Baron goes. Come a hero from the east. Free the man from in the beast. Bring the child from out the band. Drive the cursor from the land. So, to break the curse, a hero must get rid of Baba Yaga in addition to all the other things. It does not reflect well on Baba Yaga. Nothing reflects well upon that ogress. She has a face that would break all but a magic mirror. About spell. It's important for a magic user to know as many spells as possible. You never know what might come in handy. Um. Um. How should I word this, lads? You can tell me. Dazzle. Now that's a spell with charm. Its true name is Erasmus Razzle Dazzle, by the way. You can cast the spell and anyone looking directly in its carousicating light is blinded for a while and can't do anything. Um... Purple, I'll see you later. See you later. Have a good Wednesday. Co-rusticating. How should I be asking him to teach me? Ask, like, to teach Dazzle. Hmm. Oh, co-rusticating means spending time in the country with someone, like being rustic. Oh, that would be nice. I can dazzle people. I mean, ask for dazzle. I heard you guys like curses, so I'm oh. counter cursing your counter curse, <laughs> so you can stop cursing when you're curse your curse. But what about when I'm countering my counter pixels? Yeah. That's the problem I'm having. I can't counter the counter because I've been cursed to counter the counter's counter. <laughs> now that's a spell with charm. Think I need to win the spell? Yeah. Vestiges through my amazing wordplay. Play the game? What, he wants me to play a game? You must first develop more skill in the magical arts. Oh. Did you hear the joke about the witch's broom? Oh, that's a pity. <laughs> Just a little something to challenge the mind and the magic. I like to play it every now and again. But Fenris isn't much of a challenge anymore. That's because I always win. I still think you're treating somehow. Anyway, the game involves casting four spells. Flame dart, open, fetch and trigger. And to make it worth your while, if you beat me, I'll treat you a spell called Dazzle. Fetch. Fetch is a useful spell for catching and retrieving small objects in the distance. It's good for putting things in their place. Okay. Can you teach me or not? Oh, Zara has fetch. So it's different people that has all have all the different spells. Okay, that makes sense. Alright. I would download this this man now. Oh, 
Yeah, it seems we're, um... Yeah. All right, we're done here. All right, thank you. Oh, please let me leave. Uh, I know you're... No. Thank you. Well, if you really must go, we've got to leave him wanting more, lads. We can't le let him tell us when we're leaving all the time. Got to leave him wanting more. Right. We'll put a pin in it here. Do we save the game? Um, let's write, um, play game with wizard. Uh, we'll place it. So next stream, I know when we're coming back. No, thank you very much for coming, lads. Thank you very much. I've had a lovely time. What a lovely day. We tingled. We spoke. At <laughs> we spent a lot of time sneaking. We spoke about gonorrhea, which was honestly quite the highlight. <laughs> highlight of my day. Right, lads. I am going to go poop. <laughs> I'm gonna go I'm gonna go poop so you can go you can you can leave now you can <laughs> thank you you may all you may all shuffle out into your own toilets into whatever you're whatever you're gonna be up to <laughs> thank you <laughs> you for coming lads thank you very much thank you so much for all the raiders I hope you had a lovely time <laughs> Hope you have good moves as well. We will be back on Friday. Friday we are playing Final Fantasy VIII. Um, and then on Monday we could be playing more Final Fantasy VIII. Tuesday we'll be playing Tex Murphy, Mean Streets. And then Wednesday we will be back all at one at um, Quest for Glory. And I am going to shit myself if I don't go now. So thank you very much for coming, lads. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Have a good Wednesday. Have a good Thursday.